So good morning, every people. Welcome to the Four Leaf, uh, the every worst people. podcast on the side of the Every yes. one. <laughs> good morning, every people. <laughs> yes. Greetings. No. <laughs> sorry, sorry. sorry. Four p.m. in the afternoon. Uh, we, 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 it's <laughs> four in the afternoon. Later, it's the morning somewhere. It's the morning somewhere. Shut the fuck up and let him speak. Thank you. <laughs> All right. It is morning somewhere. Welcome to Four Leaf, the worst podcast on this side of the planet. I'm Clover, the Dungeon Master, along with our four fellow fickle friends, Medic the Monk, Bonk the Paladin, Patch the Rogue, and Hats and the Bard. Uh, last time, the crew endangered themselves after unknowingly oh, murdering the King of Sorospear after lighting up a blunt with holy weed blessed by Monk only to blow off the king's head. As the group are all now surrounded by the guards Monk in the king's court, prone to attack to avenge their king, and I will not. Fuck you. <laughs> You all know what happens now. Roll for initiative. Let's start this bullshit. Oh shit! Yeah, all go. right. So, <laughs> fuck. Okay, let me get into battle mode real quick. Let me just, uh, just slap my face a little oh. bit. Get that shit going. <clears throat> you already know. Oh, f he's got the extended version. <laughs> I got the extended version. Okay. Oh, oh fuck. Lord. All right. Who rolled oh, a right. one on the first roll? That's crazy, bro. Med Medic's going first. Hatson's going second. Uh, Patch is going third, and Bonk is going last. Alright. Uh, so. As the guards all surround you with your own weapons in hand, all of you are left handless. Seven guards ready. Begin. Bonk uh. said, let me say the line. <laughs> Alright. So, starting us Bonk out. Bonk said, medic, I'm the tank and you are the ammunition. So, starting out here, we've got seven guards surrounding us with our own weapons. I am the fucking weapon. Let me punch one of them in the nose real quick. Let me get that martial arts going, that Bruce Lee oh, shit. Yeah. Rolls for athletics here. Rolls an 18. Give me that shit. Oh, perfect. All right, and would you like to go ahead and use your bonus action? I would, I would indeed hit? like to use my bonus action. Ooh. Not the second hit fails, but the first hit connects. Let's see what that... One plus your plus two modifier, you do three damage to the guard. <laughs> in the face. <laughs> All right, I tried, everyone. We're dead. <laughs> All right, second up, go ahead, Hatson. Mm. Mm, let me see here. Open the... Uh... Good old character sheet of Bonk crap. Hat zone if you fail. Hats and just rolls a zero. <laughs> I'll <laughs> oh, <dies>. kill you. <laughs> um. Oh, you'll kill me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, you could. Can we really not do this right now? We're being surrounded. Can we not do this right now? We're gonna die. Bonk said, "Don't tempt me." <laughs> Very funny, Bonk. Anyways, um, I'm going to use my ancient learned skills of kung fu from my days studying at the temple monastery. <laughs> and uh, try and kick some. I think nice you're mixing ass. the two of us up. Boxing <laughs> all talk. <laughs> Whatever, he rolls for it. Go ahead and make an athletics check. It. it fails. You go ahead and go to strike the guard, but he parries your attack and goes for a counter hit. Oh, shit. Oh. Does Wait, that match? Does that match? match? All talk. This is the most intense checking I've ever seen. <laughs> it does not land. Oh, thank God. Barely. His armor class is one over. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Jesus. Okay. All right. Next up is uh, Patch's turn. Go right. right ahead. Good luck. I'm gonna sneak. Oh, you're gonna okay, sneak? Okay, okay. okay. Yeah. good, good, good. Let's see oh, if the guards see you. Watch time. The guards do not see you. They roll too low to notice as you hide behind one of the pillars in the court. You are now stealthed. Oh, fuck yeah. And one of, the, one of the guards go ahead to try to go and attack Bonk using their own halberd. They slash at him. God damn. That is a bitch. <laughs> oh, that is bad. <sighs> Wait, you gotta, you got wait, did you, you, you didn't list out the rules, bro? <laughs> it was a 20, I apologize, yeah, I no can't remember no to do that. It was a nat 20. So, Bonk gets Bonk slashed by his history. own halberd. Fuck. Ooh. Bonk takes a, <laughs> he takes a hefty slash as it slashes down across the right side of his shoulder, burrowing deep into him. He is now bleeding heavily, as now his right arm is rendered almost completely weak. Okay, great. Uh. <laughs> oh shit! All right. Okay. So that's me again, right? It's now Bonk's turn. Oh right, he did. He got. He just got attacked. Bonk said, "I turn. want to intimidate the dude that hurt me." That is not going to work with your arm not working. You're at disadvantage. You're weak. Medic, just keep them distracted as long Bonk as you can. No, don't. Okay, what are you gonna do, Bonk? Why don't you heal yourself? Alright, Bonk, Bonk. What's the plan? What is the plan here? Yeah, Bonk, I really suggest you Bonk said he'll mess. Heal yourself, alright, okay, not bad. You okay, go ahead sure. and use uh, Lay on Hands ac across yourself. You go ahead and heal yourself with the appropriate five hit points. Your arm is now fresh and dandy. 
Okay. You're back up to eight hit points. Cool. Okay. Cool. 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 It's up to me again. Um. Actually, no, it's a god's turn. Never the mind. God, the god wielding, uh, freaking Patch's rapier goes ahead and tries to attack Medic. Oh. They go ahead and slash right at him with a series of pokes here. <laughs> he rolls a five, and Medic expertly just dodges every single one of them, weaving in between each of the slashes. Oh. Medic, you get a, you, Medic, you get a counterattack before your move here. Give me that shit. All right. What would you like to do with your counter? Uh, okay, I'm gonna try and disarm him. I'm gonna try and disarm him of Ooh, the rapier. Ooh, going for the disarm. You roll a 16, and it's successful. You Fuck take yeah. The, you take the rapier as it drops to the ground, and now it is in your hands. What would you like to do now with your turn? Toss it, toss it over to Patch. Oh, shit, had it toss, to toss it over to Patch. Let's go. And it's successful! With a 16, he tosses it over to Patch, now rearmed. Um... Freaking medic made a successful throw, throwing it almost like a javelin right to their hands. Mm. It is now Hatson's turn. Hmm. You know what? Let's do this, buddy. I'm gonna inspire Bonk. Ooh, Ooh shit. Oh, you, can give an inspiration, you give an inspiration to Bonk. Uh, your turn has passed. It is now a guard's turn. After losing that halberd, uh, not halberd, the rapier, uh, the guard now goes ahead and tries to retaliate towards medic with a strike. They <laughs> won! <laughs> they won! Uh, uh, no, uh, medic, yeah. would you like to go ahead and counterattack? I would indeed. Let me teach this motherfucker a lesson. Alright, fists? Fists of fury. Fucking. Oh. <laughs> Bro. Unfortunately, you go ahead and strike back, but unfortunately his armor is just too dense for you to hit through it. Ow! Now, your attacks are mitigated. It is now back over to, uh, Hatch's turn. My fucking uh, knuckle! God! I should have enough. So basically, I'm just gonna sneak up and just take one down with my rapier. Oh, heck yeah. Alright, you go for a stealth attack. Which guard would you like to take with which of your weapons? Go for the one with fucking uh, Hatson's rapier or halberd. Yeah, I will. Yeah, I'll go for the halberd one. The halberd one. Okay, you go for the one wielding Bonk's weapon. Fuck. Unfortunately, you roll a four, and the guard notices you coming from behind, and they try to attack you back with only a four. He notices. Shit. Bro. Let's see if your check passes. It does. Oh. And you manage to switch out of the way of the halberd, leaving you and Bonk facing this one man. It is now the guard's turn as they go ahead and slash at you, Patch. Please. Okay. They roll an eight, not nearly enough to get past your athletics checks. You just dodge every single one with the big hefty halberd. All right, Bonk, it is now your turn. Bonk said, "I want to roll for perception to look for the most light one." Roll for the him up roll for the roll for perception. the lightest person oh, no. so we can pick him up and use him as a bait. <laughs> <laughs> You'll not notice that most of their armor is heavy and plated. It's too hard to get through it. You notice that it's just impossible for you to pick them up and swing them like so. Great! <laughs> Bonk said, okay, fine. Okay, what do you do then? It's all up. Let's see what he's bonk. planning here. Bonk, 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 come on. Let Murder. him cook, let Murder. him cook. Let him cook, let him cook. Bonk's gonna roll a 20. He's gonna like call down upon the heavens. Oh wait, no, that's later. Shit. Bonk <laughs> said pick up Hatson and use him as bowling ball. Brother. <laughs> he picks up Hatson. <laughs> just Please. straight up picks him up and throws him right at the enemy. It's a nine. Hatson lands on the ground. Hatson lands on the ground next to the guard. Unfortunately, now he is left at a disadvantage for his next attack here, but it does give him an opportunity here, Hatson. What would you like to do? Find his ankle. Oh, get his ankle. Okay. Mm, okay. Making the best out of a bad situation. He rolls a nat one on the disadvantage, and it fails. The guard goes ahead and stabs down at you, attempting to do so. It you goes <laughs> completely. <laughs> This is the, the worst battle of human history. He's freaking gonna trip trying to ha hit me while I'm down. He's gonna fall down to him. the ground. His sword completely gets stuck in the ground and leaves him completely vulnerable. It's Who back to your this deck. man? Oh, uh, okay, let me just run up and like knock that stooge down for getting his sword stuck in the ground like a dumbass. Let me get just his ass. Just freaking arm You're strong, with advantage arm here. Strong, like college football. For game. fuck's <laughs> sake! Even with advantage, you roll a three and completely fail. Oh no! Wait, what about the guard? 
Uh, now both of you are on equal terms as both of you are practically staring each other down the guard counterattacks. Oh, for fuck's sake! He uses his free hand to go ahead and strike at Medic, dealing how much damage here with his plates? Three damage to Medic. Aw, oh, you bitch. Jesus. Medic's still doing pretty good and healthy, though. Oh, shit. Alright, uh, it is Hatson's turn now. Hatson, Hatson, use your fucking. Use your kill. Do something! Oh, I said Hatson, All right. use on me. You know what? I'm gonna roast the absolute crap out of the guy who just tried to hit me and he failed horribly and missed and hit lodge the sword in the ground. He's he using vicious mockery. reverse move. He uses vicious mockery and insults him for his post swordmanship. <laughs> <laughs> And with this modifier, he does four damage, just absolutely hurting their pride and joy. Deserved, emotional deserved. Emotional damage. literally damage. emotional damage. Emotional. Uh, all right, all right. Not, uh, it is, yeah, Patch's turn. All right, fuck it. Um, you know what? I'm gonna try and disarm the halberd. Disarm okay, the okay, halberd? Okay, okay, you okay. go for it. You roll. You fuck. roll. Fuck. Motherfucker, dude. It fails, the two of you try to wrestle out the halberd out of their hands before they succeed and get a little bit of distance between the two of you. He Yo, strikes bro. towards you with the halberd. Uh, he rolls a two and completely misses. Who <laughs> hired this? These guards are dog shit. Alright, so as Patch dodges out of the way, now the guard is left completely defenseless as they're fully extended out, Patch. Would you like to take advantage of that with advantage? Yes. Alright, what would you like to do to attack? I'm gonna use the rapier again. All right, with advantage here. All right, you managed to beat out their armor class with your plus five modifier okay. here. Let's you go. on mod eighteen and stab them right through the chest. Mod <laughs> doing, a, doing a total of with your modifiers here, you do five damage Not to the man. Bad, All right, they are now left bleeding through their armor. You can see it dripping from underneath the metal plates. <laughs> Let's uh, go. I, we did some damage. It's Bonk's turn. Uh oh. Bonk said, "Rip out the heart of most near guard and feed it to the guard with emotional damage." <laughs> what the shit. That's gonna that's that's gonna go with disadvantage for trying to punch through solid metal. But if it works, okay, no. With, with no. disadvantage, he tries. He manages to put a crack in the metal armor that's with just his sheer strength. But he fails, and now that's he just terrifying. managed to do some basic bludgeoning damage to the guard. Uh, yeah, that, that's accurate. That's accurate. <laughs> dealing, dealing a total of three damage to the guard. The guard is now severely injured and is actually prone. Oh shit! After one of his ribs, oh. you feel it crack as you hit him right through that metal plating. Oh. God, <laughs> fucking hell! Bonk. Right. Ah, Bonk. Bonk said Chad. 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 <laughs> The guard, the guard possessing medic sickle goes ahead and tries to dash right over to him. Wait, I had a sickle. I had a running. sickle. Says what? Oh, that, I a, that was that was your starting weapon, and now oh. he goes ahead and slashes right at him wildly with the critical hit, dealing seven damage. Oh, that motherfucker! Yo, medic. <laughs> with several lacerations across, and medic's at one HP at the moment. I'm oh good. my god! Really Someone has to heal. Fucking. <laughs> I got it. I got it. I'll heal uh, medic. Not even a problem. Not a problem. <laughs> Now it is, uh, let's see, that was the guard's turn. It's Whose turn is it now? Turn. Oh yeah, uh, Hatson, go for it. Or wait, who just went the guard, but who the went guard. before this guard? Buck went before the guard. Oh, then that means it's Medic's turn. Oh, okay. it's Medic's turn. So can I, like, uh, medic. can I, like, body slam the one on the ground? <laughs> <laughs> you, even, even while you're all bloodied and cut up with disadvantage, you try to go ahead and body slam him. You're fucking 18! You go ahead, you just freaking run right over to him, even with the blood all over your body. You freaking wrap your arms around him and fling yourself backwards with a perfect full German suplex. He is taking a bunch of bludgeoning damage for that one. A perfect, perfect. six! The guard is now rendered incapacitated and unconscious on the ground. Let's is he considered just so one of those Yakuza heat events? <laughs> the guard wielding Hatson's rapier is now dawn. Let's fucking go. Hatson, take your rapier. Okay. I I'm gonna I'm gonna run over to to medic and then since uh the guy at guard with my rapier is right next to medic, I'm gonna grab my rapier and heal him at the same time. Yeah, okay. All right. You, you okay. Go ahead. 
You go ahead and use Healing Word on Medic here. Let's see. You roll a three with your spell modifier. That's a five HP, putting him up to six health. <sighs> okay, much better. Any <laughs> Anything's better than one, to be honest. All right, Medic sees a bunch of his uh, cuts now filling in the gaps as much of the blood is still there running dry. Nice. The other girls quickly approach and try to stab at you after healing them. Let's see how they roll. Fuck, 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 okay. Ooh, they roll a 12. It is enough to hit you. All right, let's see how much the sickle lands on you. Uh, Ooh, it's a three. This bitch! You get a slash across your arm as you notice the blood runs down, but you're doing just fine. All right, it is now uh, Patch's turn. All right. <clears throat> I'm going to sneak again. <laughs> okay, okay. Bonk said All right, said. you go ahead, you sneak. Let's see the roll here. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay, Patch. I'm just going to go fucking cry in a fucking corner. Sorry, hold on. <laughs> as, as, you roll, as you attempt to go across to get towards that guard, the guard notices you and reprioritizes you as their target. They rush over. The halberd guard also takes notice and tries to attack. Let's see how the halberd rolls. Okay, they roll a okay. five. Pat, Patch manages to dodge out of the way, doing oh. absolutely amazing this fight. It is now Bonk's Literally turn. What would you like to do? single injury. <laughs> Bonk said rip up the head of the dead guard with the spine on and use rip it like Rip off the head of the dead guard and spew <laughs> 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 What's that? <laughs> what is <laughs> your problem? Strength check. Oh shit! <laughs> Please don't tell me that actually works. Uh, with this plus five Are modifier, it's a mod 20. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? A mod 20! <laughs> Just rips off this guard and he manages to use it like a mace game. That's of it while doing so. Would you like to attack, Bonk? For the love of God! Bro. Bro, Bro. Bonk Bro. just ripped off someone's head and Bonk spine. Bonk's the one going for Patch. Alright, he attacks that halberd. Let's see. What Seven the fuck? Fuck? What the fuck? Hit 22. He manages to go ahead and hit that with D8 bludgeoning damage. With his, with his check, he manages to do 8 damage, severely injuring the Halberd and actually knocking them down for the count. They are gone. What that is two guards at 0 what HP. The Halberd can now retrieve. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Bonk said can also roll it's the dirty, see? I think that you have severe situation. intimidation fucking advantage at this point. After witnessing such a gruesome sight, the other guards around you all now have disadvantage for the next turn. After we're just wi witnessing that, the they're all hesitant to strike Bonk. What the fuck? Yeah. That's fair. No, yeah, that's fair. The guard with the sickle continues to try slashing at you and Hatson, Medic. Both of you roll here. God, this bitch. Oh, oh shit. he rolls at Nat 20 on Hatson. Oh, fuck. No. It's a critical hit, but Medic manages to dodge out of the way. Let's oh. see what it rolls on Hatson here. A two and a one. Oh, he does not take a whole lot of damage. He's still doing fine and dandy, just taking scratches. Oh. Hatson now remains at three HP. All right, now it is time for that is medic's turn now. All right, I'm getting real fucking sick of this guy with the sickle. I'm going full martial arts on this bitch. Give me all the modifiers. I don't care what it takes. I'm oh. taking this bitch down. She's with disadvantage uh, she's thanks to the intimidation. Me. Use inspiration. Ooh, uh, right. Ooh, okay. Because I, I used it on Bonk, but he forgot he had it, so we didn't use it. <laughs> I love this Medic, game. Would you, Medic, would you like to use your inspiration? I would indeed like to use my inspiration in this very specific circumstance. Yes, I would. <laughs> wow, you actually managed to mitigate you completely failing. You still <gasps> didn't manage to do any damage to him, but instead of falling to the ground, you clash with him instead. Okay, cool. you, to, you need to make an athletics check, try to wrestle it out of him now. He's trying to wrestle your weapon right out of your Let's hand. Let's do it. Your fist. Ooh, you managed to succeed and actually managed to get the sickle right out of their arms. It's a fist-to-fist -fist conflict now. <laughs> Hatson, it's your turn. Uh, I, I'm gonna like, okay, how many guards are left and where are they? All right, uh, as of now, there's only uh, one armed guard, which was the sickle, but now that is gone. All the guards are now unarmed. There are five guards Bonk remaining. Hatson, I will do it. Holy. And one guy on the ground, from what I remember. Do what? You'll do what? What do you want me to do, Bong? Alright, Hatson, what's your move here? Five guards remain. Well, then Bonk is giving some suggestions from the sidelines. What's his thing? Yeah. Ooh, this is something. We're actually gonna finish the fucking brutal life. <laughs> I never would have expected that. We started with a hard fight here. Bonk, what, what? Bonk, finish your thought. 
ADHD check. Or Clovey. Better play that <laughs> song next. Let me call for the rats. We don't have rats. <laughs> we don't have rats. I mean, there's a lot of rats in the right, castle. Here's what I'm gonna do. I, okay, so the guy that medic. I, I'm gonna go for just any guard, the closest one to me. Let me just uh, like freaking try and bludgeon him with my. Bonk said, "Wait, can I say the line?" Wait, you already grabbed. You grabbed your thing, dude. You grabbed your fucking. Remember when you came over by me? Oh yeah, you, me, you, you grabbed your rapier. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna stab someone. All right, with advantage due to the fear factor. Thanks to Bonk, you roll with advantage here, with your uh, plus to hit. That is a 16. That passes. Damn. You actually managed to pierce between the plating, and let's see what you get here with your modifier. That is a pl five damage. You managed to pierce them. They're now bleeding from the abdomen profusely. Nice. You need to get advantaged immediately. That guard has not Bonk much said, health left. See the line. Well, what after way? this, one of the guards is still in absolute fear from Bonk, and they run out of the premises. Ooh. What? Leave, one of the guards leave the court in horror, not wanting that to happen to them. One of the guards has left the battle. Bonk said, let me get him. <laughs> Let me get him. Let me run after him. Hatch, Hatch, it's your turn. Can I just like attempt to behead one of them? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna can... behead one of them. You only no. have six. It does not pass. The guard goes ahead and attacks back with just their fists. They do some pass the check. They do some bludgeoning damage to you, Patch. Catch you right off guard. A doing full, a four. A full four. A full All four. Right. Damn. It is now Bonk's turn. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, go on. Sound check? Let's fucking go. All right. A little bit of an intermission, please. Pardon us. Thank you. Bonk, what do you do now? This is we don't see the dice, by the way. I've ever seen. Yeah, we don't see the dice. He hasn't rolled yet. Bonk, what are you thinking? Bonk, I'm just gonna let oh, you know they not. just beat the crap out of me. <laughs> Bonk. This is weirdly intimidating that he's not saying anything while he's this is He's not saying bonk. anything, his profile picture is just freaking me the fuck bonk. out too. <laughs> bonk! 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 What, bonk. A, what is- what devious thing is he planning right now? Either he's, either he's typing up a storm about to give the most descriptive thing ever, or it's about to be just like, I punched the guy. He's, he's about to do a play-by-play -play of a fucking snuff him. film. It's probably gonna be like, I, I eat him. on AFK. <laughs> Bonk, not, no. Bonk. Normally he says something like, um... No, that was not the time! Bonk, Bonk like please! <laughs> His ping is high! <laughs> he rolled a shit internet check! Who <laughs> did that one on internet check? What's his internet check? <laughs> he rolled a one on his ethernet cord, god damn it! <laughs> Holy shit, the guard that hurt Patch used thumbs and oh my goodness, you okay. fucking monster, I love you. With the intimidation still going strong for the last round here, he rolls a night scene <laughs> with the modifiers, it works. The guard is absolutely devastated as they're now blinded. <laughs> One damage, no. To be fair, you can live without them. True, that is true. <laughs> but the guard is now absolutely devastated and bleeding, they're screaming, running into a pillar, and they knock themselves out by running into the pillar. Bro, they're not gonna look okay, so that. we're just we're just doing like the pirate strategy where we have no actual combat training, but we just scare the shit out of everybody. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's based. Another, another guard witnessing that action is even more terrified and runs out of the room. You have two guards left in the room. Whew. Oh, bro. Wow. Okay, this took a turn. Both injured profusely. They're both terrified. Smiley face. Go ahead, medic. All right. Since me and the other guy are in kind of a hand-to-hand -hand combat situation, let me just deck him in the nose real quick. Get a nice little. What? The? what the? He rolls seventeen with the plus five on hit, so that means he got a modified twenty-two here. He goes ahead and lands a hit right on them. Two damage. With the total there, it's not a lot, but the blunt force manages to knock the guard out cold. The last guard witnesses the sight, realizing it's a one v four, and promptly abandons the situation. He knows he cannot win this. <sighs> okay, let's grab all the armor. Yeah, all of now. <laughs> <sighs> you guys did it. You just managed to bludgeon an entire room of guards. And Hatson did a mortal. Bonk everything. did a mortal combat fatality. <laughs> exactly. And now, with the amount of guards you Bonk managed to kill, which was five of them, you just gained 125 XP each. After them. Oh. 
Hey, let's go. Which Long means Clover. Medic has leveled up. Yes. Hawk is leveled up. Hatson is leveled up, and Patch is leveled up. Oh uh, yeah. Of you have Long all leveled up. Clover. Isn't that a beautiful sight no. to behold? It's time. Bonk, don't for leave. Bonk don't run Clover. after them. Bonk, don't. Don't farm the human beings for XP, bro. <laughs> <laughs> As you're left alone in the quiet, desolate court of the king, we rest. you see around you all now is just Bonk's reverberant halls athletics. and corpses just strewn across the ground in the giant empty hall. Huh? You look amongst the windows as you see two masked figures hop out of sight, oh, witnessing, the fight. Again. Uh, witness the fight. Witness the fight. I got, and now, I got a couple. What would you like to do now? Uh, okay. Can okay. we just rest? Uh, I'm gonna do. Oh, I'm gonna do a perception yeah. check. Look around the room. See if there's anything like riches or valuable. Maybe Guys, some gold. What we should that the, do. That the yeah, everyone should go to one of the bodies and then loot the armor so we have better armor. And then I don't need find armor. Out if they have anything useful on them. No, I definitely need armor. need armor. As yeah, you check the. As you check all the armor, you notice that this no. armor is far too inefficient for all of you collectively and is too heavy for most of you to wear. Yeah, fuck oh, okay. The only one capable of wearing this is Bonk, and his current armor is the same kind. Oh. Oh, bro. So he's, he's just wearing fucking cardboard boxes right now, right? <laughs> like the equivalent. Yeah, pretty much. yeah, that makes sense, actually. Okay, uh, how right. about, can I roll like a perception check to see if there's any gold Bonk or riches said, stowed, away, stowed away in the king's room? Secret, secret, Go, secret. Good secret. job, me. You rolled a Bonk four. You didn't Clover. notice. You didn't notice much. Bonk, I'm not letting you eat the fucking king's head. It's, it's I don't care what you roll, my man. Bonk said, "No, not that." No, not that. The other thing. The other horrifying <laughs> act of atrocity <laughs> against mankind. <laughs> no, he said he wanted to double Bonk layer said, his double uh. Layer it. Yeah, his like, armor. Oh, double layer the armor. That is far too heavy, was... even for you, Bonk. He's trying to put it on. But you notice that the guard's armor is just a size too small for you. Yeah, that sounds about right. You're too big and beefy for these human guards. The medium instead of a large. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so now, the four of you are left in this big, empty, echoing, reverberating room. Right. You know the map, you know the lock. Can, can I take the king's ahead. crown? Oh, Actually, right, yeah, that can indeed. Wait, we can use it. Ooh, the king's crown. We can yeah, totally sell it. Yeah. We won't we get arrested. No, get, let him wear it, because everyone's scared of him. True, oh, true. He is the fucking um, king. I just realized how- wait, hold on, that's actually genius. After murdering, like, not just the king, but everyone, imagine how intimidating it is to just see someone wearing your king's crown. Let's just crown. walk out of the room. Yeah, let's just fucking- We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna get back. so many <laughs> discounts, let's go. <laughs> exactly. Alright, uh, I will now just show- 100% discount coupon. <laughs> percent. <laughs> so I will now mention that all of you just leveled up, so your health is all going up as well. Oh, thank God. Hey, thank with, your, you with your appropriate hit die, uh, Medic, would you like to roll your 1d8 hit die here? Yes, I would. You rolled a 5. Your HP goes up by an extra 5, putting you at Bonk 16 health. Nice. Bonk, with your hit die, you have a 1d10 here. Let's see how much you get. You get a 9. Damn. Voting Bonk at a staggering 22 hit points. Fucking, he's a he's a wall. He's a wall. Hatson, Hatson, you go ahead and roll your 1d8 for being a bard. You roll the one. Fuck, oh, that's rough, dude. All right, your HP does not increase by much here, unfortunately. Hey. And Patch, would you like to, you take your 1d8 hit die here? Let's see, you roll an eight. Woo! Let's go, Patch. Got a lucky roll here. Putting them at the. Thanks, fuck. All right, <laughs> I don't and. One anymore. <laughs> And as no. I have mentioned with all of you, you guys are now level 2, so that means you guys have access to a whole new array of abilities. Oh. Refer to the guys I've told you, yeah, or search cool. online. Again, feel free to search online anything you need to if you want to refer to your guide. But, anyways, Jack of all trades and Song of Rest. Every time you take a short rest, all of you are capable of being healed by your hit dies amount, thanks to Bonk. I mean, yeah. uh, have this beautiful music. Which all of you guys are all very injured right now. Your your max health went up, not your actual health. Oh, okay, yeah, let's yeah, rest then. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's rest then, yeah. I need I'll to meditate right. so I can get all my key. everything back and then destroy everyone else in the castle. All of you sit down amongst the luscious Actually, red wait. carpet that lines the halls, let's, taking a short let's, rest. What would you all uh, like to do now? Let's lie Bonk down by the- to see if the king's crown if magic. Lie, lie down, yes. Oh, Bonk's right. See if the-, the Yeah, check out the crown. The crown let's, see what let's see what's up with it. 
You use your short rest time to inspect the crown, not noticing any special properties of the crown itself magically. However, you notice the ruby embedded at the top of it amongst the gold plating that the magic has expertly woven in. A mm. diamond. Bonk oh, said I eat a ruby. Oh my You're fucking... Not, no! Bonk! No! He rolled a 16. Fuck. What does that entail? Okay, time to kill him. <laughs> yeah, we're we're gutting Can it. I use can I use my rest time to uh, just meditate and forget about everyone around me for a minute? <laughs> yes, you do. You go ahead and do that, and you Fuck manage you to actually go. You actually go ahead and restore Bonk your first two. Had so knees. No. Now, uh, medic, as I was saying with you, uh, you are now meditating, and you realize the tapped potential with inside you. You restore two key points. <sighs> I am ready to fight. <laughs> All right, yep, and you go ahead and regain your hit die, and Hatson, would you like to play your Song of Rest for everyone? Of course I will. All right, go ahead and roll the hit die for everyone else here. Uh, so Medic, being uh, 1d8, along with his Bonk, meditation, so puts I him back to max health. Yay. Bonk, along with his 18, and the double thanks to the Song of Rest, puts him at max health. Hatson gets his hit die, along with the Song of Rest, putting him at max health. And Patch, with their Song of Rest and his, also manages to put them at max HP. Okay. You successfully are now fully recovered and ready. Uh, Alright, let's please. ransack the rest of this castle. Let's go, this is yep. our house now. It's time for looting. You still have All the right. headpiece, Punk. You still have it. You st this is our house. What the fuck? He's just carrying a severed head with the spinal cord attached. I feel so bad for your vocal cords, Medic. Oh no, I can do that on a command, don't worry. <laughs> Yay. So, anyways. Can I get two clover? No! no. No, you cannot. You already already I mean, the guards are still one. here. He could technically get another one. <laughs> yeah, he actually oh. did. Use this rest time for. He <laughs> just has to rip off another <laughs> fucking skull. <laughs> Before you two adventure into the rest of the castle, I would like all of you to designate a leader to read the map. Uh, I'm pretty fucking illiterate, so I I opt uh, out of that shit. I, I feel like the choice is pretty clear. Box I don't mean to be. Oh, okay, never mind. Uh, well, yeah. either one, uh, one of you sure, two, I don't give a shit. Yeah, Pat, sure, go ahead. Wait, 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 let's flip a, flip a coin. <laughs> oh, okay, hold on. I wait, one it was literally shot. unanimous, but okay. me, but I was flip a coin because I'm too big for this. Okay, go. Heads or heads or tails, Patch? Uh, heads. Okay. It landed on its side, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's you. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Patch. Uh, if you really don't you want to do map, it. I'll right? do it. Read the map. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. I'll, I'll make this really entertaining with my circumstances. All right, Patch. So you yeah. already have the map. You have the PNG, right? No. Uh, no. I'm swearing. Oh shoot. I'm swearing off Bush Kush for the rest of my life. Swearing off Bush Kush. <laughs> All right. So you go ahead and take hold of the map. You see the simple layout of what you have walked through, and I'm gonna have to load up Krita for this. <laughs> Yay. We're we are so prepared. We're very, we're know, very right? professional here at Four Leaf D&D Podcast. Bonk said, "Why got some yes, right welcome, here, man?" Yes, uh, welcome everyone. I do you get that shit things. away from me, Bonk. I am never smoking that shit again. <laughs> Literally played Russian roulette, committed deicide, and uh, fought, uh, killed seven people over some bush kush, bro. I'm done. I'm done. I'm I'm going cold turkey. It's over. All right, Patch, you read yeah. this now. Uh, amongst the king's court, you now have the central upstairs. Which path would you like to follow? Mm -hmm. There. Ooh, wait. Bonk said, "Can't so, take since the we're king's in, like, robe." We're in the king's court, right? Yes, oh, you left. Right. You're just at the door of the king's court, central upstairs. So anywhere Bonk linking the central upstairs, you can go. go. All right. Bonk, I, I don't want to go. I oh, want to Bonk, check Bonk said one last thing. Sorry for cutting you off. Oh yeah. Oh, before you go, yes, you can take the king's robe. You can pillage that. Bonk, you have like two no, people just, here who want to stab you. Can I take the king's robe and wear it? Yes, wear it, wear it, wear the she, robe and the. Yes, wear, wear it, wear it. Yeah, wear, wear all of it. She wears the robe over his metal armor, matching perfectly with the silver sheen. He sees the purple silk just glistening along with the armor. It matches perfectly. Hold on, let me get let me get the whiz. There we Patch, go. Patch, go right ahead. It is all you now, Patch. Where would you like to take the group? I want to check out that one single room. It's just like just that left room. The left room? Yeah, the left room. I thought it was exactly a good idea. Yeah. Alright, as you go ahead, you sneak around trying to keep steer of any guards nearby, and you all manage to go ahead to that leftwards room. You notice a bed and when you enter the room, noticed with purple curtains strewn across all over. It's beautiful, as if it was made just for the king themselves. Hmm. It seems like this is their chambers. Oh, we should have taken a rest start, here. Start fucking, start looting. Yeah, start let's looting. rest again. Okay. <laughs> no, wait, so 
over. Let's start fucking looting. Yeah, let's loot everything. And yeah. then uh, we, we should all four roll a perception check to see if we find anything interesting. We do a bit of ransacking. Yeah. All right, all of you roll some perception checks with uh, Bonk and Hatson both doing well. With Hatson getting the first uh, top initiative, I'll actually give this to him first. So as he checks around the room, he notices a dresser that he opens up and finds the contents of not only a journal, but also a jewelry box. Which would you like to take first? Take both of them. Why do I, what, what do, you, why do I have hands. to? What, what do you mean? Why Bonk, do you have to Bonk, gets, Bonk gets the other. Oh. 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 You mean the journal. Yeah, because he can read. Purple was rare back in the day. It that was. is true. That is true. You had to crush all right. Creatures. So as you go inside and read the journal, you notice all sorts of contents, labeling day-to-day -day activities, schedules, and more. You notice the king had a very strict schedule and seems Bob to be said, almost. So take anything purple. <laughs> yes. You notice a lot on the clock, as it seems as though this man has never had a free moment in his life. Poor but, however, as you. As you scroll through more and more, you notice a straight page not attached to the rest of them. Wait, bro, scroll through? Yes. Yes. And you, you notice- You can scroll through a book, you fucking troglet- No, okay, I'm kidding. Sorry, yeah, cool. <laughs> you, you notice a straight card- Bob said, glad I killed this guy. <laughs> yes. As you notice a straight card labeled in ink, seemingly almost bloody, you huh. notice a calling card. Would you like to read the contents? What? Yeah, of that course. That shit is I'm a demonic at... spell, do not read that. Wait, I'm not gonna read it out loud, I'm just gonna read it in my head. Like, dude, I'm looking at the thing. What does it say? Everything just starts floating. <laughs> <laughs> as, as you read the note, silence, please. To the king whom we which find well, you may not know us, but we know who you may find. You are well under our thumb, and we bear no hostility towards you. However, we wish for you to only remain silent. Upon any mention of this sigil, we shall be forced to terminate this. However, we wish for you only to remain silent in this armistice. Failure to comply shall result in consequence, and with all certainty, we will follow through. Below, me below the message is an illustration of the sigil, and you can see a diamond-shaped sigil marked with several curly swirled patterns in a stone engravement. Oh, fuck. Okay, so... The plot thickens. This king was under the thumb of whoever's behind these sigils and that weird-ass obelisk. This, this eyes-wide-shut bullshit... Oh shit, okay, wow. There is no real bunk. This is creepy as fuck. Okay, okay right. uh, pocket that note. Especially the red one. No, I'm taking the journal. The whole thing. I, I already sure, mentioned whatever. everything there is in the room. Don't rope. worry. There is nothing in the robe, don't worry. Oh, okay. Examine right. the robe. Anyways, with the other uh, succeeded uh, perception checks, with the box jewelry box, there is nothing in the robe. <laughs> 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 you, you, you examine the robe and notice it is in fact a robe. It's rolling. It There you go. <laughs> now. <laughs> This is gonna be unlistenable. Let Meta get it out of the system. Alright. While he's dying, I'm gonna continue this. So, anyways. Uh, you notice a a metal jewelry box also inside of the dresser, and you go ahead and open its contents. Inside, you see a special ring with a green sigil on it. Uh, oh shit! Another who would like? To, who said, would like to, you attempt to wear the ring, but Why? it does not go around your finger. It almost rejects you. You feel some sort of magical let's, presence from this ring. Let's run like a, a I don't know whatever check it is to see what uh, perception. Like, if, what, what the thing is on the ring. Bonk said I you mean, the ring. Perception? Yeah, perception. Do that. Alright, you go ahead and inspect the ring. Ooh. You rolled an 18 on the history check. You notice this ring is imbued with some sort of special energy and must be attuned to in order for its abilities to activate on the wearer. Oh. Can I wear it? This, this requires some sort of short rest for you to attune to it. Oh, let's... let's, let's just rest here again. Can I intimidate the is there, ring? Is there anything that, that um, like, is... 
Well, okay, hold Bonk on. said Clover. Yes, no, you cannot Shut intimidate the fuck them. up, Bonk. Can you stop Bonk, talking? Just be quiet, please. Bonk okay, said, listen. let me do it. First oh of God. all, um, is is there like anything that we haven't regenerated? Or not? Uh, no, you guys are completely we're at full, full health. You're well rested. Um, uh, Based on the king's schedule, is there anything, like, can, can we take a rest so we can figure out what that does, or no? Uh, looking at the king's schedule, you see that he usually falls asleep at about 10 p.m. sharp almost every single night. Maybe we have to follow What's the cool? schedule. Maybe. Like, okay, what so, he's under the ruling and the thumb of, an, of, like, an occult-like organization, right? And his entire schedule you know is dictated what? by them. Maybe we, maybe we shouldn't be pushing our luck here. Let's let's investigate the other rooms, loot the stuff, so we can get out of here. Yeah, that's fine. Right. What, okay, what time is it now, though? That's the question. Bonk said, uh, pass me the ring. Well, you enter this kingdom at about 10 a.m., and it is now noon. Dude. Yeah, just dead noon. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's keep and looking, cool. then. All right, all right, Patch, Patch you are oh, captain. Let's go. All right, again, one at a time here. Patch, what would you like to do? Um, you could take the ring, right? Yes. Uh, yeah. Uh, Hatson inspected the ring, uh, okay. and noticed it's a magical ring that requires an attunement to use. Bonk said, okay. "Give me ring." No, oh. you can't wear it. Your finger's too fat. <laughs> <I'm serious. laughs> that's some. That's some fucking fighting words right there, bro. Alright, so anyways, again, Monks I swear to god, if you say- ring to fit. No, Cut it my skin off. for the ring to fit. I mean, you've got, you've got a, another very, very small part of your body that I feel like the ring could fit on. I mean, it's- <laughs> Don't! No, it's okay, let's, 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 let's just ignore the fact that you got a 2 okay. on that roll. <laughs> Okay. All right. So, uh, anyways, uh, Patch, we continue outwards. Uh, by the way, I already know you're about to type something bonk or someone else, so please don't say anything. <laughs> so, Patch, as bonk you examine the map from, I knew it. <laughs> so, Patch, as yeah. you go ahead and examine the map. Where would you like to take the crew next? Okay. Um, I want to go across from us first because I want to check out these like the rest of the room. So I'm gonna go across. So the one on the right. Okay. All right. So the one. When you when you face the uh, king's core when you're like leaving out, it'd be like oh. on the right. Okay, as you yeah. go ahead, as you go ahead and enter the room, you see what seems to be some sort of conference room where business is noted. You see a billboard oh, just displaying different kinds of sheets of paper and all sorts of different tactile measurements. Oh, a tapestry. You notice strung papers across there, as if there was supposed to be some sort of conference today. Huh. Okay. I want to check Bonk out the said, papers. Can I examine it? <laughs> yeah, let's examine that. Yeah. You examine the papers, noticing all sorts of schedules set especially towards nighttime. You also notice a strange mention of several kinds of rocks and gems. Yeah, no, this has to be some kind of like uh, day-night okay. cycle thing. Can we do a? Can I take all the shit? Yeah. Bonk let's said, take "Can it. I look for books?" All right. You it's go a ahead conference room. The... What are we gonna take? You store all the papers for later reference. Oh, I guess. Can all right. I have a perception check. There is no perception to roll for nothing of interest Bonk else just in this room. Alright, all right, next room. Whoop. Next room. Alright, you go in the room. Right. <laughs> the next room. Alright, as you go ahead and go over to the next room, you see you go into what seems to be some sort of castle archives. You see a large library mm. filled with books and scriptures going as high as the ceiling possibly can. Well, I'm out. Said, I can't can read. I <laughs> I, I can I can read and Hatson can read too. We can, let's just check it out. Good luck. I'm gonna go meditate more. As, pa as Patch goes, cracks open the door. They notice a suspicious amount of guards in specifically this room. They oh. see three hosting just in this room, surrounding the bookcases. All right. Yo, oh. yo, yo, Patch, stealth to right. check out the shit. Right. Stealth yeah. in to yeah. grab Bonk something. Said, hey, can you guys read right. dark magic Art books for me? Your stealth. Sneak up behind them and then slit their neck. Or you could just All like right. okay. With sure. advantage here, Patch goes I'll ahead. Think... With the plus five and stealth they have, they actually manage to pass their passive perception with a 17. Nice. Patch manages to sneak up behind one of the guards, and now manages to slit their neck completely silently. The other two guards are still unnoticing. Oh. Let's Ooh. fucking go. All right. Would you like to go take care of the other two, Patch? XP yes. grind the guards. All right, still with advantage here. You roll an 11 with the plus 5 in stealth, you manage to pass Bonk the check again. One more guard is eliminated, patch. one guard remains. Fuck you. Yeah. Alright, again. Try, come on, try your luck, try your luck. <laughs> Manages to successfully stealth and kill all five guards without even a single hint noted to your location. Based. All of them are now strewn silently across the ground, and you gain a little bit of XP. Let's go. 
Let's go. All right. Nice job, Patch. All right. Thank you. You are all now free to examine the room. Okay. Monk let's go. said, "Take right. the skin of one of them." Oh my oh, God. God. Would you like to roll some perception checks in this case? Yes, please. Let please. us do that. Ooh. All right. All of you managed to pass the check except for Hatson. <laughs> All right. Damn. All right. So, firstly, is medic. Uh, where would you like to examine in the room? Uh, there are several tables mentioning different kinds of equipment, and there's bookcases. Um, I guess the tables. I'm not fucking with books right now. So let's go for the, one of the tables. <laughs> As you look amongst the tables, it seems to be all sorts of different workspaces and different fields of science, gemology, geology, and biology even. What? You keep looking across the tables and you notice one specifically in chemistry. You see a, some kind of flask holding some sort of liquid. Would you like to take it? I would like to take it, yes. All right. Next up is Patch. What would you like right. to examine? The books. All right. As you examine all the books, you notice a very rough outer exterior. As you notice, the leather here is almost withered from how old it is. You look through the books and notice a very large emphasis on all sorts of different kinds of gems and their properties, going from carrots to weight to light to reflectiveness to anything that you want. Okay. Huh. And lastly, oh, uh, for you, Hatson. Again, examining the room, as the others have already examined, you notice that the bookshelves almost are, well, lined perfectly, seeming to go about three feet apart as if they were rafters for each, leading all the way up to the ceiling part. You can see the wooden beams on the ceiling. Monk said, what about me? You lost the check. All right, what would you like to do now? You know, maybe I could do an acrobatics Monk check. Monk said, oh, can I look for dark magic books? Look for dark magic books? All oh, right, okay. let me roll a check on that. All right, with your, what was it, minus one in wisdom or plus one? I can't remember. Let me check. All right, so as you go ahead and look amongst the bookcases, you scroll looking for all sorts of different kinds of magic incantations. You notice all sorts of different spells that you can't seem to know just the words of a cast. These are beyond your control. These are meant for a wizard. Ah, uh -huh. shit. Okay, um, so Ooh. since there's, like, rafters in these areas, can I do an acrobatics check to try and get myself up there? Just, like, you know, get a little scope of the room since it's so fucking high up. Absolutely. Let's go ahead. Well, 13 with your plus, was it 5 in acrobatics? I believe so. Let me double check. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yes, indeed. You go ahead and check up with the plus 4, my bad, in acrobatics with the 17. You manage to use the bookcase's shelves almost like a ladder. You notice that these go unexceptionally high for what some reason. You continue crawling higher and higher until you manage to go amongst the wooden beams, Monk's and you it. actually see almost a door far off in the distance. Ooh. <laughs> Alright, this is the Twilight Zone, let's open it. <laughs> you want to go in there alone? Sure, I'll just peek inside, you know, at most, to start out. You know, just, All right. just in case it's like a black hole or God himself waiting to smite me. That's just like peek. <laughs> <laughs> Once you peek inside, you notice the sight of what seems to be some wooden instruments, a wooden desk, and many sorts of instruments and papers amongst it. Okay. So, so, like, like instruments like music? No. Scientific oh. instruments. Oh, shit. Okay. So this is like a fucking torture room or some shit. This is some Albert to said, man, they like wood. They really do like wood in this place, don't they? <laughs> Would you like to bring the rest of them up here? Sure. Come up, boys. All right, you go ahead and go Bonk into your explorer's wait. pack to bring up the 50 feet of Bonk rope. said, can I look for books about sigils? Not a bad idea. That is a good All right. idea. All right. Nat 20. Nat 20. As you look amongst the books, as you look amongst the books, nothing in the original catalog has any sorts of mentions of sigils, not even when you check above and under, but you do seem to mention one book that has almost a mention of it, but ambiguously. Huh. Very, very vague shit. Got it. So they don't talk about it or put it in writing all that often. Good to know. You can take the book for reference. All right. As Medic goes ahead and uses the rope in his explorer's pack to bring it all down for you guys, you all go ahead and climb up to the upper studies of this place. What would you all like to do now? Let's go inside. All right. As you go ahead and enter into the area, you see a conceited study area with a large wooden desk absolutely covered in dust, almost an inch thick. Golly. <laughs> as, well as, several small, as well as several small tables filled with equipment, as well as a personal selection of literature on a small shelf beside it. Clearly they don't clean. I know. As you, all, as you all enter the desolate room, you feel an almost nostalgic feeling breeze and course through the air, as you are met with the sight of that desk, only lit by one singular window amongst it, and the darkness coinciding the rest of the room. 
Shit, okay. Wait, one of us has dark vision, right? So we can, like, check what's actually in here? It's still dark in the room, even with your dark vision. Shit. Okay, this is like some... This has so to be some kind of dark, like... Dark. Yeah. Footsteps. This is advanced darkness! <laughs> um... Okay, what's, there, what's the move here? Okay, just... How about a perception check to see what's on the desk, or inside the desk, if anything? Any drawers, any... You're 14, you notice that some parts of the desk have streaks of where areas are dust are missing. Oh. You notice that they seem to lead to some some kinds of folders and books, especially. Okay, let's check out these books then. Folders. Filing. Would you, li would you like to go ahead and light up a candle to read it? Yeah, sure. Alright, you light up the candle and you go ahead and read the uh, documents. You notice one in particular catches your eye. Document number seven. Oh. Alright, Pat, you got this. you're illiterate. Pat, you got this. <laughs> no, it just, it just looks interesting. There's a nice picture in here. <laughs> <laughs> it's a nice picture book. <laughs> See, come on, take a look. I'll put the, I'll give you the candle here. Take it. Uh, uh, thanks, thanks, bud. Yeah, no problem. So, right. document seven. Bonk said, "Can I intimidate Hat Zone for no reason?" What the no. fuck? And Bonk, please stop interrupting all of my narrations. This happens every single time. <laughs> Bonk said, "Okay, fine." Slash. Thank you, Bonk. All right. So, document seven. Upon further discretion, it is clear that the men I sent to that chasm have at last made a return, the first of their kind to do so. Up oh, until now, whether it was they have received certainly worked, as for the last six expeditions, those teams haven't returned. In total, we have expended 23 men. However, as we have discovered, only one of these men have returned. We supplied them each with one of the crystals we had found from the, ex uh, the expurgated site. The last two documents that have been shown shown that the gems were not enough alone. Those gems which we have found seem to have some kind of protective effect in the chasm, and we were discovered to have worked at full, full capacity once in tune with the material they managed to salvage. That crisp golden resource. The one that the sixth crew managed to salvage. Apparently upon record of the first to return, the other's crystals didn't act the same as his did. There was a strange sense of attunement he and his crystal had possessed, as though it protected him, unlike the others. He did it. He found a way. He was the first to first to traverse the room. Wow. Bonk said, what wait, fuck? what about that ruby that, that I ate? Crazy. Oh, crap. What do you mean, ate? You, did, you didn't, you didn't roll eat it. You didn't, you didn't roll, roll 20. 20. You didn't eat it. Oh, thank God. Okay, so these right. fucking sigils are way Bonk special. Said, oh. Like, way special. Like, these things are valuable. These have a purpose. The crown has got a sigil. That weird arthropod centipede bitch had a sigil, and the mask had a sigil, right? This so, entire kingdom is just worth of sigils. Yeah, this is all sigil. So this has got to have something to do with the hole in the middle of the town. 100%. 110%. So, <laughs> shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> As you read on and finally finish the document, as you're about to flip to another, you notice the candle that you're standing near flickers. What? It seems to almost be disturbed by something. Oh, fuck oh, this. Where do no. Look what around. Everyone, you? everyone, all the perceptions. Look yeah, around perception, everywhere. Perception check, please, everyone. Hatson was the only one who managed to notice it. As the candle flickered, he advises everyone to get out of the way as the flame on the tip of the candle explodes into a light show. Long oh, said, oh, shit. God. Oh, Lord. In an array of color, the candle Bonk explodes. Said, Can I pray to the god worship for knowledge? Bonk. <laughs> Dog. As, all of you, as all of you manage to get out of the way of the candle, nearly avoiding all those burns, the darkness still doesn't let up despite the flash of light. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. You notice that some of the papers and books catch a light. Oh, okay. I, 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 I'm we, we can't put. We can't. We have to put it. We have to put out the fire. Let's, no, let's the leave. Fire let's on. leave. I'm out. I'm out. Leave. There's I'm... like th two other fucking places we Long have to check eight. out. That's my God. Leave the. Like, yeah, we went up into the rafters from the library where we can still still just like go back down. Let's just get Ooh. out of this hellhole. Said, guys, <laughs> let's, let's put out the fire. Yeah, put out the fire. Fine, fine. Let's, let's try. Let's try and God. put out the fire somehow. What do we have to put out fires? As you, go ahead and attempt to put out, as you go ahead and attempt to put out the fire from the darkness, you notice a dagger gets flung right at you. Oh, you need to make his dexterity save. These ones you. again. They always have daggers. This, oh. These masked bitches. Oh, sorry. As, as Hatson tried to do it, he managed to dodge out of the way, and the darkness is unveiled for you all. That wasn't actual darkness. That was a spell. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, hell no. Nah. 
that's why you couldn't see it even with your dark vision. Bonk said, "Can I spit at the flames?" I don't think that'll do anything. I don't think it's gonna do I'm pretty anything. Pretty sure it's not gonna do much. The flames are continuing to grow in size. It does manage to mitigate them down a little bit, just you being such a fucking half orc, but <laughs> it does not stop the fire entirely. You notice two masked men in the corner of the room, each prone to attack. Yeah, we're at incredible disadvantage here. They can Bonk like said, they can like refract the light. Mace. Let's leave. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, let's leave. Barricade the door, and then run downstairs, and check the other rooms, and then run out. Yeah, As you all go ahead and attempt to leave the room, one of the masked men goes ahead and casts something with their hands, and they fire a firebolt, no! blocking the door. Okay, <laughs> all right. Um, all right, so I guess alike. we are fighting. I guess we are fighting. All right, the room's me? continuing to spill with smoke as it's just you, t you four against these two. Monk said, "Fuck it, mace time." Yeah, I think it's mace yeah, time. Yeah, right. Yeah, it's fight time. Initiative time. It's time for music. And Bonk goes first. Bonk is the oh, first no, to go good. first. Don't worry. Alright, Bonk. What do you wish to do first? Oh, shit. Bonk said make the masked men piss their pants. That's not gonna work. We're surrounded right, by go ahead, and, go ahead and roll for intimidation. Bonk said no, don't. You really go for intimidation? Alright. Bonk said don't. Then what do you want to do? Because I'm gonna take what you say literally, Bonk. Yeah, this is not the time for jokes. Bonk. Bonk. Bonk is deep in thought right now. No. Uh -oh. This is your first time fighting Bonk a spellcaster. Okay, fine, do it and fucking scream at the same time. Alright. Intimidating as possible. And plus he has plus on it due to being a half orc. Good he fails. job. Good. Hold on, where is it? As the, f <laughs> As the fire behind you continues to rage on, that same spellcaster goes ahead and flicks their hand towards it, and it goes in another flashing light show as it goes ahead and explodes towards you. Oh shit. Oh my you god. To get, you manage to get out of the way as it continues roaring higher and higher, the building's still on fire. And continues to cover more and more of the room, it's beginning to come filled with smoke. Patch, it's your turn. Uh... I'm gonna find a way, um, you know what, I'm gonna... S I can't even sneak, it's too bright. Way too bright. You know what? Way too bright, so I'm just gonna, like, try and at least decapitate one. Okay. Alright, which one? Do you wish to go- Do you wish for the spellcaster or for the dagger? Spellcaster, spellcaster, spellcaster! spellcaster. Alright, you go ahead and try to attack the spellcaster, but unfortunately, he is too swift for you. You see him activate an almost superhuman ability, and he seems to jump across the entire room in one bound. The fuck? What? As he leaps across the room, you see him just going more and more agile. This is no mere human ability. The one with the dagger goes ahead and attacks you, Patch. Goes ahead and slashes towards you. I this game. It goes past your armor class, so it manages to land. Bro. A one. Uh, I'm a, trying to think. I'm trying to one. think. This masked man is fucking racist. <laughs> what? <laughs> Against elves? He, wait. Against Asians. Oh. What? Excuse me. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, go ahead, it is your turn, Medic. Alright, um, let's put this key to the fucking test. I'm gonna try my damnedest with my acrobatics to try and catch up to the superhuman spellcaster bitch, give him a good one too. Alright, so which key ability do you wish to use? Shit, okay, so there's Flurry of Strikes, but that's only... Okay. Flurry of Blows, Patient Defense, and Step of Wind. Um, I Step of the wind. wind, Step of the Wind. Yeah. You go ahead and harness all the key in your body as you're invigorated with some sort of special movement. Your speed is now doubled to 60 feet. <laughs> Let's get him. What would you- you gonna go over and run over to yeah, him? Yeah, I'm running over, I'm going in full force. He's got spells, I've got fists. Let's get going this- in a flash, Going in a flash of speed, you look like a blur as you run right to him, getting ready to engage, make your move. Oh fuck, okay. Let me just give, give him a good old sock in the nose, go for the face, get that mask off of him. I hate my life. <laughs> <laughs> the man still seems to be almost beyond capability as he goes ahead and leaps across the room once again near the middle. He goes ahead and tosses out another fireball aiming right at Patch. <laughs> Bro, why me? Poor it manages Patch. to connect. Patch is just on fire. <laughs> it's just on fire. Oh shit, that was a really good roll for us. A three out of All four. Right. Patch manages to get caught by the fireball, singeing one of their boots, but they're still luckily doing pretty okay. Bonk, we need Bonk. a miracle. We need one of your nat 20s. We need one of your nat 20s, man. Maybe take care of the dagger guy so we have one less thing to worry about, because this guy's a fucking monster. Please, Bonk. Bonk said I tripped the fast dude with my leg and then grabbed him, break his spine like a stick. 
I guess I could try and corner him so that, he like, has right. no choice but to run that into your foot. I don't know. Alright, as he's hopping over, you go ahead and try to do so. Bro! Unfortunately, with his speed, as you go ahead and lead your leg right in front of where he was about to be, you rolled a 2, unfortunately. As he goes ahead and runs right over to you, you're about to fall right into your leg before you realize, while still mid-air, he jumps again. Wow. He double jumps. Bro. He double jumps. We're it's fucked. It's over. He goes, ahead and, he goes ahead and attacks towards Hatson. This man he manages, he manages to just barely get Hatson and tries to try, try to hit him with a full-forced fireball. Oh, dear. Oh my god! It's um, an 11. It hit. Said and with Hatson's HP, that brings him down to zero. He is now knocked down. Fuck, fuck, oh fuck, 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 fuck. When you're at zero fuck, HP, said, now it's piece. time for you to learn how death safes work. Once per turn now, you must go ahead and roll a d20. If it's a 10 and under, you must put down one on death. You get an 11 or above, you get one on life. Oh, Aww. okay. So you're down for three turns now, at least. Oh. You're not dead, though. But, uh, He's each turn you, that passes for you, you you're gonna roll a d20. So let's go ahead and make your first death save. Oh, great. He succeeds. One point for you. You're staying alive for now. Alright, it is now back to Patch's turn. Okay. Um, I'll... Uh. I, I wanna use my cunning action. You wanna use your cunning action and gain an extra ability? Okay. Yeah. That bonus action is. What do you wish to use it for? Uh, I, I, I'm gonna see if I can try and get him again. Just trying to decapitate him. You want to dash towards him? Yeah. All uh, right. You go ahead and use your dash and try to go for a swinging strike again. You get an eleven just over his armor class. You managed to connect. Nice. Nice. Oh, with a perfect Let's roll go. with a D8. Perfect. You managed to stab him right through the abdomen, piercing him. He's now holding his side as he's now slightly hindered. Okay, right. good, 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 yeah, good, 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 good. The one with the the one with the dagger goes ahead and tries to step in to make this a two v one and steps in with his dagger. Rolling a nine, just Ooh. not enough to hit you. You manage to dodge out of the way, just simply cutting off a few strands of hair. <laughs> Holy shit! All right, Hatson, go ahead. Oh, oh, because he's not dead yet. He's mm. still doing. You know, I I think I think I might that's attack right. somebody. Yeah, no, of course. <gasps> You rolled a 20, that's two That's two check saves, you're back with one HP, you're stabilized. Nice! Holy shit! He managed to survive his first death save with a nat 20. That yeah. means you're still prone, you're still on the ground, you're not gonna be able to move really, but you can still at least make a small action. So, no, no, no. can you heal? Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretend, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretend like I'm still down so they don't play know dead. I'm up. Play dead, right. yes. Alright, All right. and then dead. I'm gonna heal myself. Ooh, you heal yourself while you're down. Not a bad idea. Go ahead and restore 3 HP. You stabilize your current condition. Alright. Alright, go ahead. Uh, go ahead, Medic. What do you wish to do? Alright, since he's a little hindered because of Patch's recent attack, and I know the fireballs come from his fucking hands, I'm gonna try and use um, the, uh, the skill again, Flight, whatever. Fuck, what's it called? Step of the Wind? Step of the Wind. I'm gonna use Step of the Wind. I'm gonna try and go for the arm this time, not the face. All right, Sorry. rolling with advantage with your speed advantage. Go ahead and get a 10 with your plus four and strike. That's a 14, it beats his armor class. You managed to go ahead and strike him. Two, both two damage, damage. Both hit, do one plus two. Let's see, that is four damage total. The man is, let me check here. He's incapacitated. Oh, oh thank God. Oh. The man. The man is locked unconscious, but not dead, and there, all that remains is the dagger. Bonk, make your move. Bonk said grab the dagger man by the neck and slam him to ground like a goblin. <laughs> you're, gonna, oh, you're gonna do the medic special, got you, bro. <laughs> Go for the medic special! Yes, he got the 20! Yes, this really is a medic special, baby! While the dagger still got distracted by his comrade being down, Bonk goes ahead and grabs him and slams him right into the ground, floorboard splintering all over as he's instantly over. knocked out. The man is rendered unconscious, and the room is now going up in smoke. And now, you have managed to survive the battle. Whew. Now, all that remains is the fire around you. I will leave you guys two turns to do whatever in this room before you are required to leave. Okay. Inspect the masked men. Inspect the masked men immediately. Just immediately grab the mask. Oh, loot them. Loot them. Grab everything. Bonk grab said, everything. "Take the magic man's hand, brother." The hand isn't the the magic part. 
As you go ahead and inspect the two corpses, the mask goes ahead and begins to shake violently as it flies off through the window. It's doing this again. It's, do it's going it's back to the it obelisk. Again. It's doing it again. It's going back to the obelisk. All right, let's fucking get, go. Within the magician's robe, nothing can really be found except for the fact that the robe is made with a silk red. Huh. A silk red? And the other still seems to have another three daggers in their belt. Okay. Bonk said, let me wear it. What? Bro. He's Two just gonna robes. he's gonna have trophies of every single person he kills with robes. <laughs> Alright, you guys have one turn left in this room. What would you like to do? Uh, what else can we do? I'll, um, I, I wanna try and save it, those books. That's the thing. Yeah, the, the files, the files, the files. Yeah, the files. Save save the files. Alright, most as you go ahead and try to get to the files, you notice that the firebolts previously aimed in this fight was meticulously aimed at the files to destroy them. Jeez, that bitch. There remains, there remains nothing left of the files, and now you must use your turn on something else. Shit. Oh, fuck. Um, grab the equipment. equipment yeah, the equipment. Yeah. You grab the equipment, you notice all sorts- robe. Yes, you did. As you go ahead and go amongst all of the different glass cases, instruments, beakers, and more, you go ahead and grab many of them, noticing which especially one to catch your eye. Some sort- of, Wow, that was really well timing for a fucking glass breaking. Wow. Yeah, it was uh, really good. What the hell? Jesus. Oh, fuck. Wait, that's- This is just supposed that was to be really a pretty- really good. <laughs> okay. Bro, so, okay. Okay, what are the odds of that? So, as all of you go ahead and exit, you notice one of the glasses seem to contain some sort of special kind of artifact inside. Ooh. All of you all of you go ahead and leap out the only exit remaining a window as smoke fumes out of those ceilings. You go ahead and hop right out, and you have escaped this nightmare. Whew. You are now remaining as you Long hop into the hedges right outside. <laughs> roll for how badass it is? Yeah. Go, right? Let's see who has the most stylish one. Wow, no, all of you sucked. All of you fell out somewhat gracefully, except for Hatson. He kind of just, like, stays there, like, he's flanking through the air. <laughs> all of you fall into the hedges in the garden below, as you are now su uh, subjected to the streets below. You now all have a bounty on your heads, and they are looking for you. Yeah. Bonk said, let's go to the sewer quick. But, n why? No! Why do you want to go to the sewer? As all of you no, go ahead and- get a He wants to go back No, to no, okay, I refuse to follow this. No, the answer is no. I don't no. care. Uh, how about we follow the floating mask going towards the obelisk? <laughs> well, why? We know where it's going. Bonk, Bonk, well, it might do something Bonk, different. Bonk rolls the perception check and notices a draining system for all the flowers in the garden. A nice place to hide from the people looking for you. Okay, wait, we're just in the garden. Let's go loot the other rooms. There has to be a treasury or an armory somewhere in here. As you attempt to go back, you really want to go back? As you it's attempt only... to go back to the oh. rooms, you go ahead and peek behind the hedges and notice that right. guards are absolutely flooding the doorways. They yeah. don't let you guys leaving the building. Oh. Yeah. Wow. So there's yeah. no point of going back inside. Okay. Yeah. yeah let's. Right. Yeah. Let's yeah. fuck this place. <laughs> they all believe you're still in the building. Bro. Yeah. I think we need to leave. Okay. Do you all wish to go uh, hide in the sewer, or do you wish to go run to the streets? What time is it? As of now, it is 1 p.m. It is broad daylight, and you're just witnessing the simple city streets of this village. Okay. Well, yeah, the what, they're time. gonna put out. Uh, let's guards. just like let's just like walk around and like, hey guys, say hello to your new king, Bonk. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna. They just found. They see guards coming out, ready to kill whoever comes out, and then you see Bonk, Bonk with a crown Bonk and a robe. Who do you think is not gonna snitch? The Bonk, Bonk said, do goes it. through the sewers. And then we walk through town because like no one normal knows who people, we are. no one knows. Yeah, who Bonk we are. go in the sewers. The sewer king, Bonk goes through the sewers. Ooh. Oh, you can recruit rats, since you have your crown and your robe. <gasps> you and do you're in the sewers. He's the he can rat be the rat king. He can be the rat king. Go. He can be the rat king. Go. Bonk enters. Bonk enters. Bonk enters the sewers as he is still wearing the king's crown to avoid detention from all of you. All of you are now free to explore the streets as Bonk goes ahead and explores the contents of the sewer system below. Damn. Yeah, okay. Sick. Okay, good. Alright. Awesome. Alright, so... Now we can be normal civilizers. <laughs> or, or if we can get anything quickly, like, if is there a general store or... Um, as all of you, as all of you go around the town... I found a god. <laughs> you know, if it would be anywhere, it would be in a sewer. It yeah. would be in a sewer. It would. As all of you go ahead and try to explore around town, you notice parades of soldiers marching across, searching for someone. 
You also right. notice. Oh, you also oh, notice parchments who... strewn across. You also notice parchments strewn quickly across the town. They seem to be almost posters of you with your faces and a numerical count next to them. Ah, okay. okay. So, uh, okay. I, I, can awesome. I check out the? Can I have a perception <laughs> check on Mom that poster? Dumbass, come down here. <laughs> what? We know what it is already. <laughs> it's our bounties. Well. As you read closer, you notice the different numbers on the bounties and who has higher and lower bounties. Okay. Oh. oh. Who has the highest? Yeah, who has the highest bounties? Well, bounties. <laughs> as, you, me. as you look within the bounties, you notice Medic has a staggering 1,600 gold piece bounty on his head. What? Hey, turn me, guys, turn me in. You guys need the money. <laughs> yeah, exactly, that's what I was thinking. As you all look at the quickly drawn uh, poster of Bonk, you notice an 1,800 gold piece bounty on his head. Oh. No way. Man, these, 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 these motherfuckers are racist against half orcs, bro. As you look at Patch's bounty, you notice a 1,300 gold piece bounty on her head. And as you look at Hatson, you notice a 1,200 gold piece bounty on his head. Fucking racist, bro. Oh. Half the half orc prejudice is crazy. Bonk bro. said, "Okay, hat zone." It's it's because you know Bonk I'm, I'm said, a... bye. What? Bro. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Trying to, he's trying to get that bag. <laughs> he's trying to get that bag. Bonk <laughs> said, "We are turning you in." <laughs> I'm worth the least. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's it's right. the, the principle. Now, now that all of you. All of you are all freshly injured here. Would all of you like to go ahead and take a short rest if you'd like? Yeah, yes. let's. We're not welcome in this town, so let's rest and then like yeah, get the fuck out, out of here. here first and then rest outside of town. Yeah, that's fair. All right, Hatson, you, Hatson, you have managed to be stabilized Bonson, after that near-death rest. experience and actually almost dying on that roll with the window. By the way, um, oh. you you are now thankfully alive. You are the first member to nearly die. Awesome. Jesus. All right. Now, as you all take a short rest, you guys all have all sorts of actions you can do here, like using some small abilities or inspecting items you already have to gain further notice on them. Bonk said, "May I look for rest?" Or an attunement. Since and yes, Bonk, you may look for rat. Yeah. Since Bonk, I, since Bonk I will use his rest to look for rats. I should be attuned to that ring now. He gathers three rats. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> t uh, t check that <laughs> ring. Check rats. Actually, no. Heal yourself. I can check oh. the ring or patch. Yeah, heal. Oh, by the way. Oh, right, Bonk said, can I tame the rats? My bad. Yes, and yeah. I'm the one with the ring on, so... Okay, yeah, check the ring. Okay. As you check the ring, you notice a certain energy between the two of you. As time passes, you notice the ring seems to almost become more accustomed to you as it manages to go farther and farther down your finger comfortably. Huh. You notice it has a fit almost for you, and you now know the abilities of the ring. You have obtained the ring of mind shielding. Oh, mind shielding? Oh, mind shielding? You are now complete... I need that. You are now completely yeah, immune to being. You're now completely immune to having your mind read by any sort of telepathic ability. Wait, who has the ring again? I completely fucking forgot. Hatson. Hatson. And since he's Hatson. hard with charisma, that means he can actually lie, even if he's going someone uh, who said, can yeah, see through it. it. That is a one. really good combo. You know, check that shit. Keep well, that shit. Even Bonk agrees. See. Yeah, give it to the smart. Yeah, give it to the smart guy. Thanks. Give it to the guy with yeah. a brain, because like they're gonna fucking yeah. mind read me, and it's gonna be white noise. Instead would you of like the to guy who's borderline on, on, like, freaking animalistic intelligence. Wait, what, what'd you say, about Clover? Uh, since you went ahead and grabbed all those instruments, would you like to examine amongst all oh, those Oh, yeah, we probably should, yeah. Alright, let's break all them right. open. <laughs> no, let's just look ahead, for now. As you go ahead and look inside the glass cases, you don't see too much, but you do see especially one shiny gold coin that seems much bigger than the usual currency you're used to seeing. Hmm. A medallion of sorts? Inspect. Source? Inspect. All right. Uh, who would like to inspect it? I can Bonk do that. Said, may tame the three rats. Oh, I can do All that right. one. All right, Medic, as you go ahead and hold the coin, you notice a distinct energy almost preventing you from touching it. It floats just above your hand. Huh? This also has some sort of magic energy and must be attuned to in order for its ability to be used. Ooh, I'm going to see what that shit does. I'm going to keep that in the backpack, have it float next to my spine. Kill time. All right. <laughs> you, you, you spend your short rest to attune to the coin of luck. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. You now, now, thanks to attuning to it, you now know its abilities. During combat, or any sort of scenario, once per long rest, you are capable of flipping it. Heads, you now get advantage on your next roll. Tails, you get disadvantage on your next roll. That is cool. I'm Mario partying up in this bitch. Bonk said, give me Go that, I real. need that, you know that medic. No, 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 it's mine. No, 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 let medic have it. When I'm roasting an ultra kill player, and, and all they start sudden, tossing they start coins throwing in the quarters air. in the air. <laughs> I don't know, Medic has the Ultra Kill coin. <laughs> he's, just, he's just gonna punch it. I can just- Yeah! Fistful of dollar. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
Wait. You literally I need to do that. Stats for it too. Fistful of data. I need to do that shit. I need to do that Over, shit once. The next time, short rest the next time I find a motherfucking goblin, I'm gonna do flip the oh, coin in no. the air. You Take the, the coin. All right, Bonk in goes ahead. <laughs> Bonk goes ahead and enjoys the quiet, dim light in the sewers with the grates passing through. As he notices a specific gleam from the ruby in the crown, he goes ahead and attempts to pick it out, and manages with his brute strength and just sheer pincer grip, manages to pull the ruby out of the crown despite it being woven. Oh. He manages to see that the ruby has some sort of special property to it, although not innately an ability, but it's certainly not normal. Okay, okay, cool, cool. So he got the worst loot. Alright. Loot. <laughs> no, all right, Bonk. It's important, but you don't know what Bonk said, look at it more. Look at it harder. <laughs> As you look harder, you see it. You look at it harder, and you notice it's red. <laughs> <laughs> we need to include Bonk's profile picture in the fucking overlay this time. Bonk said, can I tame rats? Yes, you tame more rats. Let's see. Let's roll for rats here. Roll for rats! <laughs> the... You roll a seven, you obtain two more rats. You now have five rats at your disposal. This is. Oh my gosh, she's what gonna the start like, reading them. This is disturbing. Right. Can we pick up some right. dog food kibble inside of town? Did Patch, and did Patch use her. Rats. Did Rat Patch use her. Bonk is too? literally gonna become the Piper. Return. What would you all like to do? Wait, did Patch do. Did Patch do the thing in the rest? Fist stage? Uh, there was only two, uh. Magic it items. Really magic oh, okay, okay, but is, there, is there anything else you could do? No. no. Uh. Any other things you wish to examine? I mean, we've got like. Oh, we we still got those like that Let's thing that we, we got. Can, from like, that, maybe the journal that... pages, the book. Did did we check that one thing that we got Bonk from said, that room that was rats. on fire? You go ahead and examine some of the charred notes. You notice to go ahead and look further. As you examine further, you take note of the fact that one man in particular had managed to return from that chasm, and you okay. notice a distinct yeah. importance with that man in particular. Ooh. Guess what I have, guys. Guess what I have. There's this handy dandy spell. It's called mending. Oh, and so it's oh, oh my god. Maybe, genius. Maybe, maybe, genius. Genius. Maybe, maybe, maybe. So clap that up. Clap that up. You know what? I Even I wasn't expecting that. So you know what? That is just well played. I'm just that smart. GG. GG. Yep. You know what? I am completely, you know, I'm allowing that because even though I didn't Make more of this ready. I am completely ready for this because that's just well fucking played. Dude, let's fucking go, dude. That's <laughs> <laughs> not stupid. Uh, no, a... I'm that stupid. I don't know about you guys. Bonk said, "Can I look at the book that vaguely talks sigils?" Uh, yes. Just after this, really quick. So, as you go ahead and restore more of the documents, you see more and more detailed versions of what seems to be these experiments they were running before, talking about expeditions to chasms. And as you keep reading, you go ahead and see a list of names, most names crossed out. You see Colin Zander. As you look through all of them, Bonk said, "Wait, that hole." I'm never gonna remember those names. <laughs> as you look through all of them, only one name is not crossed out: Colin Zander. T Colin. Colin, Colin Zander. Zander. They are they are the one that returned. Call him Xander. Call if you him. wish to if you wish to figure out how to survive in that hole, it appears you must know how he did as well. Let's find Bonk this guy. Name. I I guess let's let's yeah let's just go look for him. Let's just ask around town. Hey. Bro, we're we ever... wanted. We have bounties. Uh, okay, we gotta come up with a disguise. Let's cover our faces with mud. <laughs> Bro. Wait. Much are... Fuck, no, never mind, the, f the mask already flew away. Shit. Uh, <laughs> also, also, by the way, thanks to your short rest, you recovered your key points. Oh, yeah. Anyway, the mask already flew away, so we can't wear that. Bonk we need some way to hide our identity. Yeah, I am. I'm, I'm, the moronic gene is kicking in. <laughs> uh, fuck. Hold on. We gotta find some way to disguise ourselves, get, get more information on this Colin guy. So what do you guys really think? Do. Patch, you can stealth. Oh, uh, hey, what's up? Yes, I can. So just like go up, ask somebody, get the answers, and before they can realize it's you, just like disappear. <laughs> oh wait, I could, I could do okay. I could, I could actually do something else, but sure. Yeah, no. So something along those lines. All You're right. the sneaky one, so maybe we All can. All right. Hey, can I just, you know, uh, yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna walk away from these guys for a second, just hide behind uh. the thingy. Just you know, just just <laughs> just, just stalk uh, us I'm, I'm the just whole time. Swap clothes. As you're, you're hidden, 
As you hide in the bushes near the building nearby, it seems to be a residential area, you notice more and more guards stomping about. But, co but countering their path, you see what seems to be almost a mail delivery serviceman walking some other way. Mm, follow him. All right, I'm going to follow him. All right, as you continue Agreed. pursuing, let's see if your stealth check works out well here. Oh, Lord please, Jesus. please. <laughs> the man sees you, but doesn't think too much of it. He, right. he finds it a little strange you're walking down his path as well, but it happens. Start he just whistling. continues onwards. Start whistling. Be as casual as possible. Start whistling. <laughs> just, 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 uh, just, uh, you know, just casually Bonk just said, walk around. Are you fucking serious? I'm not fucking... I could probably do that if I'm close enough. Don't! <laughs> Don't steal. I'm not, I'm That's not, a federal I'm not, offense. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not I'm, okay. Fine. Pay your taxes. Stop <laughs> it. I didn't. What the fuck? That's so what the hell was medic part of? <laughs> what? <laughs> He's a fucking IRS medic. <laughs> <laughs> I heard you haven't paid your taxes yet. <laughs> yeah. Um. Can I just follow this fucking mailman, please? Yeah. Just. Just pretend you're like looking around. Look around very casually. Yeah, just look around very casually and then take him to the side and just fucking strip him. What? Pardon? What? I'm going to wear his clothes and look at other stuff. If I go into his little like post office, I can literally just look at anything. We'll find this where this guy fucking lives. All right, go ahead. You go ahead and roll for that right there. You're gonna go ahead and knock him out. <laughs> roll for yeah, that. <laughs> with the modifier. That's a modified 22. Modified 22. You successfully managed to knock him out and don the outfit with a successful disguise. This poor right. You continue in the direction. You, you continue. You go ahead and leave him on the sideways, leaving him in some bushes nearby. Alright. <laughs> As you continue down the pathway, you realize you almost have neared your location. You notice what seems to be some sort of central mail deposit. Ooh. Go ahead and enter the building. Go to the front and notice that, for the most part, just seems to be most of what's usual. People checking in stamps, people making letters, and, well, mailing much more. You notice that there is a back door leading to the back areas of the mail service and the front. Where would you like to go? Patch's bounty went up like 2,000 gold pieces right now. <laughs> Don't worry, I am constantly updating you guys' bounties. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm walking, I'm walking into the back to just check it, just check out, you know, some stuff. Hey, there are four right, people. Look at the mail, see where it's going, as look at the addresses. As you go Boxes ahead and walk- the most hot? <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, yes, yours is the most high. Uh, so, yeah. as you go ahead and walk in through the back door of the people in there, make some passive perception checks. Both of them may fail to uh, look through your disguise as you continue on through. They just think, ah oh, yes, that is my co-worker. <laughs> Go ahead and look through and you see the mail deposits listing the addresses for each person here in this town. I yeah. know where you live. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. 192 right. 60 steps, sir. Alright, I'm gonna look for the one yes, guy. We have a girl co <laughs> is, it really, is, is that really that unbelievable? All right, you rolled a nat 20 on this as you go ahead and peer through all of the mail services here. Sometimes. You go ahead and notice specifically one address. You go ahead and continue on and you notice the name. Colin Zander. Let's go. There we go, I got the address, baby. <laughs> Hell yeah. All right, get back to us, Patch. Yeah, I'm, I'm heading back. Good work, I'm just casually. Casually. All right, you go ahead and drop the letters and proceed to walk out. Uh, you notice that they find it strange that you walked in with mail and never even dispersed it. So with disadvantage here, oh, sure. they go ahead and check your outfit. Yeah. 16, they sense nothing wrong <sighs> but just the hair off. Oh, yes. Maybe it was a personal emergency. Go ahead and walk out the back door and return <laughs> to the others. Yay. Yes. Hey, yo, guys, I got you guys hours. something. They, they don't care. They, no. <laughs> okay, um, what is that? What is that squiggly that you got there? What is that? I got I got us an address, Bob my guy. What's an address? address? <laughs> fuck, I don't even fucking... Well, I found us where he lives. Who's he? <laughs> well, as you go ahead and keep the scribbled note down, you know the exact address. It seems like he borders the very outer edge of this kingdom here. Then onward right. we shall go. Get the fuck out yes. of this place. Let's go. You continue onwards north. As you realize, more and more guards stampede the streets. This is the highest security the kingdom has seen in a uh. long time. <laughs> well, I'm still in this disguise Bonk as long as I'm away from them. Me. Bonk is still fine. You're just in the sewers. I'm pretty sure you just like know where we are just by proxy. <laughs> he's just, Bonk, he's gonna, goes he's ahead, Bonk goes ahead and moves an through the sewers. Rats. Bonk's <laughs> like, can I tame more rats? Yep. Roll for rats. Roll for rats. 
Each time your turn passes the around, great, I'll give you a chance here. The, the great rat war of, of I don't know. You tame three more rats. You now have a total of eight rats by your side. <laughs> what, what the fuck? All right. So, as you all continue down the streets, you see the biggest wave of soldiers yet. Mm -hmm. This is almost unavoidable as they seem to cover nearly the entire width of the street. What would you like to react? Um... I'm gonna just co come down. Oh, uh, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, we fuck, might have fuck, to fuck. settle to fucking sewers. Uh, yeah, jump in the sewer. So I'm jumping the sewer. All right, let's, let's go ahead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy my go fellow ahead. sewer rat half orc. Let's go ahead and roll and see if there's any manholes nearby. Please. All right, one of you just managed to notice Woo! the sewer hole cover that's right in the middle of where they're walking. Ah, oh, thank God. Hey, we jumping in. Yeah, we're All right. Out of here. All right, with medics blinding speed, you manage to go ahead and lead in first while the others two go right behind. Just as you manage to go in, they manage to pass by the area. All right, Long said Suo guys. All right I'm going to take off this fucking postman. What's wrong with the mail outfit? Officer let's, fucking... Let's... I am not going to wear Long a fucking mailman outfit while we're fighting someone. Don't be... Don't, they're going to think you're a civilian, then you're going to be able to sneak easier. Bro, You'll be at advantage fuck. in stealth checks. Think about it. All I could Think, imagine, Mark. <laughs> all I could just imagine is like they just like get beat their ass beat by a postman. By a fucking they postman. go home. They start crying. <laughs> Monk said, "More rats." Just like so. How is work, honey? Uh, <laughs> also, Bonk, it's not your turn on the rotation yet. Sorry. So, anyways, as all of you, is that a low res? Um, yeah. yeah I'm not <laughs> 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 Don't even worry about it. So, as all four of you navigate through the sewers, you continue as you hear the iridescent footsteps crumbling across the top of the area. They just sound heavier and heavier with the several hundred pounds of armor that is just walking across oh, the stone gonna path. Break That's the fucking concerning. Floor. That's concerning. You all continue along this maze of pipeworks trying to find the exact address. It's going to be hard to do so, but you know you can. Go right ahead. Okay, um. It's Bonk's just like. The new what? Pied Piper, well, you should've chosen the, the freaking bar. Since I've got blinding speeds on my side, how about I just A-train it up, just fucking Bonk's like dash through wait. every single pipe I can until I find any semblance wait. of the edge of Bonk's town. Said wait. Sorry, wait, Bonk, medic. you turn on the rotation, my guy. Bonk goes said, ahead. let me ask the rats. <laughs> I speak for the rats. Do you want, yeah. Medic, do you want to, do you want to relinquish your turn to Bonk? Um, eh, let's see what he has to offer, let's, let's see what the rats say. All right, roll for animal handling. Thanks, hey, thanks for that. Wait, Bonk, you and I make the best team. I have, a I have so such good animal handling, dude. Ooh. Oh the my god, they, they found they found something to agree upon. The world's gonna you fucking implode. Exactly. Do you wish to work together? Yeah, we'll work together. I'll, 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 he, he is the, he is the master of. Bonk the said I tamed them to hate hat zone. What? <laughs> <laughs> Please, for the love of God, uh, please, uh, please uh, be uh, the uh, bigger, uh, be the uh, bigger uh, person, uh, be the bigger uh, person, uh, Hudson. Uh, Hudson, uh, please be the. Uh, okay, he's just, he's just well, joshing he's, you. He's okay. just joshing you. Okay, okay. go ahead and roll animal handling. Let's see with advent with his uh. Oh, all right. With the plus, he manages to roll a fourteen, and he actually manages to convince the rats to give good locations. <laughs> The rats go ahead and continue north as they all manage to lead forward like a pack of wolves going ahead and just leading right through the water currents. Mm, you notice that holy. you notice it only seems to get darker and darker as less manhole covers are lighting the ways and less street paints. Please tell me this is just another fucking spell. Um, all right. All right. Wait, yeah, well, you Hatch, Hatch, uh, how would you like to lead for this turn? Me uh I'll honestly Oh wait, I still have like wait what? We still have lanterns. Oh yeah, we do. Oh, oh, said, wait guys, I have to pee. We also... Don't worry, Bonk, it's not your oh, turn. Yeah, no worries, no, yeah no worries. I, I gotta go pee too. I'll go while Bonk is. Roll All for right, pee! <laughs> Alright, let's see how good this You both one succeed. Of pisses, one of their pisses was mid as shit. Damn, that's rough. <laughs> Alright, Patch, so what do you do next? Alright, um... Uh, yeah, well, I'm just gonna use my lantern. If we all have lanterns, we never fucking use it. I mean, we're 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 have, we have we have dark vision though. We can just like I, I, look. And stuff. We can use one of the lanterns. We're fine. H Hatson's the one person that doesn't have dark vision. Yeah, so then he's he's, he's I, not wait, here. Wait, who has dark vision? Do I have dark vision? Everyone, everyone, have dark everyone vision except Hatson because he's human. Oh yeah. 
You're an elf. They're half orcs. Hats and human. Okay. Yeah, we can um, we can see in this shit. We've got like Minecraft night vision. We're good. <laughs> That's perfect. All right. As all of you, as all of you continue through the sewer systems, some of you manage to split, leaving medic and ha uh, medic and patch in a group together. Well, bonk. Bonk and Hatson are both in their group on the other side of the hat. Oh, no, 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 Let's split up, gang. Bonk said what? As you all continue walking forwards, you two come towards a uh, conclusion of dead end and you go ahead and try to catch up to Bonk and Hatson. Awesome. Oh, thank God. Bonk all right. said WTF. We're just walking, we're walking. Down, I'm walking. No worries. We're just walking, we're, we're just we're walking. We're walking here. We're walking. <laughs> all right, but anyways, yeah, Bonk we're doing said, just. I did not wash my hands. Oh my that, God. That, that TMI, dude. TMI. <laughs> I mean, hey, he's just—he's just—he's just, he's just, he's just has to have like some extra. Yes, he, he, he needs advantage on the rats. He is half orking right now. He's—he's he's playing the character. He's playing the role. He's half, he's half orking it. He's. I don't think he's playing the character. <laughs> my anymore, favorite part. Right? My favorite part of Four Leaf was when Bonk said it's half orking time and half orks all <laughs> over the bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> that was truly one of the half orked oh. moments of all time. <laughs> Oh, it's half working time. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. All right. So, uh, as you all continue walking in, you notice that due to the lack of drains, the water levels seem to almost be even higher here as they slowly trickle out towards the south parts. Seems like that this part of the town seems to be much more active than the rest. Oh. Wait, are you For telling what? Seems like the water, uh, looking down towards the middle Long part, said, seems like they're the almost reaching they the paths. Drown. Oh, look at that, he's caring for the rats. You managed to Aww. pick all of them up, and you are carrying them all on your shoulders. Oh, wow. that's cute. Bo they they probably have rats. so many I diseases. I can't do that for me when I'm dying on the floor. Hey, rats are cool. You know what, <laughs> based... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... As all four of you continue walking, you notice that the darkness still doesn't grow Long any fainter for anyone also. except... Except for Hatson, he's, you know, he's a human, so unfortunately his sight is kind of... Eh. You know what? I'll guide him. I'll guide him. I'll let... I'll... I'll... We'll be your <laughs> eyes, Hatson. We'll be your I'll eyes, be But I have the rats. My animal... Fair enough. Oh, that's How good is my animal handling, anyways? It's like... Bonk said, no, I do. Both of you do, actually. You're both really good with this. But anyways... Okay. So, uh, as we continue here, uh, with Medic, Patch, Hatson, and Bonk all continuing onwards here, Deeper into the no uh, deeper into the nodes of the sewers, the water level seems to almost reach up to your shins now. Oh, that's ew. not good. You're noticing it's starting to become a very slow dredge, and this terrain is very difficult to walk through. Ew. Fuck this place. Let's, uh, get... let's let's go the rest of the way up top. As you continue. Yeah, okay, what about the guards up. though? I'd rather get like my I'd rather get like typhus well, than we'll die. <laughs> As you continue down the sewers farther and farther, with the noting of the uh, mantle hatches above you, you notice a distinct sound going down the tunnel. Some kind of growl. <laughs> nope, I'm out. All right. Oh yeah, fuck you! I'm going uh, to deal with the guards I take back everything I said. Let's go. to grind humans for XP. <laughs> Bonk said tame it. The Doomslayer. <laughs> Alright, uh, so, uh, which one of you would like to go ahead and try to push that manhole cover? Those things are heavy as Bonk shit, by the way. <laughs> I got this. Tame it, Bonk. You want to tame whatever's down there? No, okay, I'll check first, and then Bonk can try whatever bullshit Bonk is cooking up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Medic, with your night vision, you manage to keep going down further and further, trying to explore alongside all of the paths here, and you notice it all leads down to one linear path, and you notice what seems to be most irregular. Would you like to go ahead and make an observation check to see if you properly identify it? It's observing time. Ooh. Oh, he, notices okay. it, nice. he notices it perfectly. He may not na have much knowledge on many things, but he certainly knows what this is. As he looks, he sees two rotund eyes looking back at him, gleaming amongst the water, with only a snout sticking out. It's a fucking alligator. Sees, it's fluffy! <laughs> it is not fluffy, it is scaly. Oh, <laughs> it's a fucking oh. sewer gator. What you is it a it, It's the crocodile. It's a, I knew it! It's a gator! It's a gator! <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, Bonk, you can go ahead and tame it. I'm running the opposite Bonk direction. Ahead. Tame it. Bonk, Bonk's gonna go ahead and take a risk here with this animal taming. Alright, let's see what he does. Get this us two together. Oh, uh, an he was an even ten. ten. The alligator continues staring, just floating towards him, okay. getting ever slightly closer. Hats in your turn. 
That's in your turn. I have a plus four in animal handling or something like that. Plus two. No, 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 because I got my, uh... Look, so I have my animal handling stat there, right? My skill, and then... I don't know, there's there's this little dot next to it, like it's selected. Oh yeah, and I okay. I have my, um... Plus my, four here. Uh, so you want to try my, animal handling? Addition from my... What is it? My... Oh, right, from the thing that I'm not supposed to tell anyone Yeah, about. that one. So, would you like to go ahead and try animal handling? Yes. Alright. It snarls, it growls. You go ahead and approach it. You notice a certain kind of uneasiness as you get closer and closer. You hear a very sl faint bubbling coming from this it. This is not a normal alligator. This is like a chimera or some shit. He's hiding halfway below the water. He's not being tamed. This isn't an animal. This is like a demon. Let's run! <laughs> yeah, Medic, Medic you want to try to go ahead and roll for that manhole? Yeah, yeah. Roll, 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 roll. roll. Thanks. Thanks. It's, yeah. far, it's, far, it's far too heavy. Man I'm, I'm covers are hundreds of pounds. I'm just gonna do this for myself. Alright, can, can, can I try and open it? Can I try All right, and open it? You go ahead and roll for the manhole cover. You oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're carrying me. You're carrying although, me. Although, oh, with the nat 20, although you lack the strength to properly lift it, you know the right amount of finesse to use the power of leverage to lift it right off the ground. Well, let's go. With <gasps> right, knowledge, you managed to open up an exit way that Medic soon follows through. Hats and uh, Bonk are both down here Bonk now. Bonk said intimidate the gator to join us and piss. Bro, what? All right, All right. checks out. Go ahead. What do you mean checks here. out? The nut you rolled a 19! What does this mean? We have a pet gator now? Do we have a pet gator? As he goes ahead and tries to uh, convince the gator, you must make a sacrifice, Bonk. I will allow you to do this if you use one of the rats as food to convince <gasps> it. <gasps> this is like <laughs> Sophie's choice. No. No. Oh my Where's God. the sad music? Where's the sad music? Wait, someone just start playing sad music. Oh. Would you like to feed it one of your rats Bonk's in order to it. tame it? Oh. oh, the dot dot dot. It's beastly Bonk, nature can't Bonk. be convinced otherwise. Exactly. Bonk. Bonk said I feed it the mace. <gasps> the head mace! The head mace, though, he's still carrying it! Gators are man eaters! It managed to see the flesh, still fresh with blood, as it still seems to have been not too long ago. Alligator accepts it graciously and chops too. down on it. No it didn't, way. It didn't I didn't expect the sufficient amount of meat, but it's convinced the alligator traverses. It steps up from amongst the water and walks Bonk alongside you. Clover. That's amazing. We actually have a pet fucking pet, gator. right? But mice? I said mice. Rice. Mouses. Mice. We've the got second mouses. time, like rats. We have pet rats now, and now we have a gator. Bonk said rats and a gator. This is the second time that I was surprised uh, by an action. I didn't. I completely forgot about the mace and forgot that. Yeah, that's meat too. I thought that was the only kind of meat you guys had. No, Although, I mean, we do the I mean are, are our rations meat? We we never really specify no. what our rations are. Yeah. No, the, ra no, the rations are kind of like pirate food, like hardtack. Oh, cool. Uh, <laughs> okay. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. But we've never even eaten our rations because yeah, we've literally we never had our rations <laughs> before. I'm actually. I'm, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. Bonk used his brain. Honestly, right. big brain. Let's call the oh. other two down here, and then we'll go ahead with our. Okay, yeah, uh, I'm coming back down. Yeah, you know what? I'll come down too. Even though we, I use so I train much strength, it so I can ride it. He's gonna mount the gator. <laughs> He's gonna mount the gator. Oh my gosh! Unfortunately, you are a half orc. You are too tall. But if you were someone like a gnome or a dwarf, you probably could. Or a Wait, human. Or a human, maybe. Does he really? Too large. Humans are too large. Too so large. Fun. I've what? seen humans no. ride gators. I've seen never. Steve Irwin on an alligator. Yeah, <laughs> this is some <laughs> <laughs> fucking stuff. Okay, hold on. It's However, okay, all right. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Oh, no. However, I never said how tall I was, Clover. We we are. We, we are <laughs> he's, he's a he's a two foot half orc. <laughs> half, half orcs are over six feet tall. <laughs> he's a two foot half orc. No. <laughs> If anyone were to be shortest here, it would be Patch. Uh, we already agreed that Patch was the shortest one. Wait, really? Yeah. I thought Elves were naturally right an alligator. Patch, do you really want to go for it? Oh. Yeah, I'll, I'll, get, I'll, I'll try it. Fuck it, it's why not? It's your funeral. <laughs> the crocodile is slightly agitated by the weight amongst its back. It goes ahead and just freaking hops up a little bit to try to shake you off, and it does rodeo style. You have fallen off. It lets out a slight growl towards you. But it's like, honestly, I, can I, can, I can imagine, like, Patch trying to mount the alligator, and then it just throws, 
her off, and Patch is like covered in sewage. Oh, uh, that's we're all so... It's just like a while, full-on while anime moment. Just like, like oh. yeah. oh. <laughs> roll for embarrassment. <laughs> yeah, roll for embarrassment. <laughs> <laughs> roll the eighteen. Patch is extreme. All right. Dude, I I would be to be totally honest. <laughs> As all of you go ahead and uh, reach near the ends of the sewer, you notice well, that it's finally. Patch. Damn. 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 <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna have to kill you next round. Fuck you. Uh, so can I can I, I teach these people how to breathe for 15 seconds? Bong said he's my boy. <laughs> he's he's yeah. my boy. He's, he's our boy. Come on. <laughs> Imagine medic just just like okay, I'm gonna teach you guys how to meditate for a good two seconds. <laughs> no, Monk no, said, can I no. Give him belly here, here, just br what breathe in, yes, breathe in give... through your no, nose medic, hole. I do not want to deal with this. No, I breathe no, in I'm through your nose hole. I don't no, breathe out care, through medic. your mouth hole. I do not care. In <laughs> through. <laughs> I am letting Hatton kill him. <laughs> I'm not going to kill Bonk because me and him are now animal parents together. Oh, thank God. Oh, Co-parents. They found. They oh, actually no, found a fucking Bonk. I'm beefing they, Bonk now. They found an actual thing to agree upon. Patch, I am very Patch, happy. it is not worth it. Patch. So, mm. as the two of you go ahead and boot. And this is the first time you Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a, I'm gonna put a, I'm gonna put a supportive hand on Patch's shoulder to alleviate the embarrassment. Roll for comfort. Roll for comfort. You roll a four. Bonk said, can I okay, I just that? made her very can uncomfortable. I <laughs> can I Hold knock on. the fuck out of Bonk? You go ahead and you go ahead and try to just simply freaking. All right, let's let's see how hard you slap him. That is a nat oh 18. Not 18. It's okay, the crocodile. It's, it is successful. Oh uh, well, okay. How does the crocodile react to that? <laughs> The crocodile and the I'm crocodile. gonna eat the crocodile! I'm gonna be bonk after this! Please, please. It... Also, this is the first session that Bonk hasn't eaten something. I know it takes one bad day, but come on. Sure. Alright, so, uh, anyways, now all is settled. As you all approach near the end of the sewer tunnel, you notice that it just divinates into three last choices. Ooh. Okay, me and Bonk, Hatch, and then Medic. Let's all divide. Oh, okay, so I'm just alone. Yeah, sure, let's go. <laughs> All right. You you are left, alone. Patch is left alone, middle, and then left alone. middle and right. Who wishes? I'll go right. Right's always right. I go middle. You know what? You know what? Sh bonk. Sh yeah. Should I should I take the rats and go with Patch? You you have the you have the alligator. I mean, we're both probably fine our own. And I'm just a, a a fucking prodigy, so I'm good. <laughs> like I, I don't know. What do you think? The I'm fucking you animal for parents here are just. Yeah, talking they're just about negotiating the custody real quick. <laughs> They're like negotiating custody agreements. Bonk said I use the rope use lease for the gator. <laughs> to make a leash? <laughs> oh, yeah. Leash on the gator. Leash the gator. <laughs> leash the gator. All right. He goes ahead and uses the leash on the gator. It's now domestic to Bonk. That is amazing. I love that. I love uh, that. And, and it, is, it bears no hostility towards uh, Patson, but it's still, well, unknown for uh, Patch and Medic. Okay, I'm, I'll do I'll do a petting check later, but audience. for now I'm just gonna go on the right path. All right, Pitbull Gator. Pitbull Gator. <laughs> Pitbull Gator. Your 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 Pitbull has leveled up after defeating a hundred toddlers. Oh no! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Bro. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do something horrible real quick. Damn it! <laughs> All right. So, medic, as you go ahead and take the right, me my water, you <laughs> as medic goes ahead and takes the right path, he goes ahead and just reaches up into the household. He tries to go ahead and see the site. It seems to be what is a two-floor apartment building, as he seems to have come up through the toilet somehow. Oh, okay. I'm surprised they fit. <laughs> <laughs> These are medieval toilets. Oh, okay. So oh. Got it. So I'm gonna roll for disgust. <laughs> Here is my gator. Oh, I'm not disgusted in the slightest. A nat one. <laughs> nat one. He's not disgusted at all. No, no debuff for you. Yay. Right. Would you like to go ahead and explore the house oh, with it? Yes, I would. Perception check. Literally the bathroom. Bonk I want to steal all their medicine. With me, medic. You check the medicine cabinet, cabinet, and you find what seems to be. Two <laughs> <laughs> 
managed to find two medieval equi uh, equivalents of Adderall. <laughs> uh, yeah! Adderall. Let's also, go. Known, also, also known as crack cocaine. Get to the gator. Fuck yeah, dude. Get to the gator. Cocaine gator. We're making a sequel to you Cocaine Bear. <laughs> I'm pocketing that shit. Give me the drugs. All right. Alright, uh, we're gonna keep going here with Medic until he finishes his expedition, and then we're gonna go ahead and follow you guys. Alright. Medic? Medic? Uh, let me just, uh, crack open Wait, the bathroom the door. Way. Come on. Check around the hallway, maybe. Look at the- look at what's in the All house. Right. Alright, you go ahead and check around the house. You will on that one. So I go blind. <laughs> <laughs> all you can, all you can see, all you can see around you is just simply the dining table that's in the room, and you can't really see too far into any of the other rooms around you besides this dining table. You would think that becoming a half work in a game of D and D would get rid of my eye problems, but, <laughs> said, you the game <laughs> but I guess it translates way too fucking well. I'm eternally in glasses and everything ever. Bring the hat for Bonk the gator. Wait, Clover. Okay. Um, all right, Bonk, This is medic. All right, let, right let me go. Ch let me go check the dining table. See if they have any food. I don't know. <laughs> All right, you go ahead and inspect the table. You got a three. Uh, you see some Salisbury steak. Uh, it's been there about half eaten. Uh, fork still present, and there's a light on. Mmm, steak. Let me just eat that shit real quick. Roll for delicious. Roll for delicious. It's Salisbury steak. Oh, my oh God. yeah. We need this. We it's need a nice this. hearty meal. All right. So, All right. So what was that light illuminating earlier? Let me roll a check for that. All right. Go ahead, check around the house. You notice that there's a light on in another room. It seems to be candlelight falling from another room, and here's footsteps. Oh, oh shit. Um, hide. Hide. All right. He goes ahead, rolls for stealth. He rolls a nine. Uh, with his <laughs> dexterity bonus, he has a uh, eleven at the moment. Okay. Uh. As the person walks down, you notice a small middle-aged woman seems to be about five feet, maybe oh. sixty years old or so, walking oh. down, coming back for their food. They oh. notice that their food is gone, uh. and their meal is gone as they came back with a glass of water. I'm so they have, sorry. They begin to check around the house to see if they notice what could have possibly taken it, but unfortunately, due to their poor old eyesight, they cannot see. I'm a fucking right monster. Medic. I failed to see you Medic. right under the table. I'm a fucking monster. Medic. I don't. <laughs> Medic. Roll for Bonk mental breakdown. Break down. <laughs> and we're going. And the rest. Break down. Break down. Oh, it's a ten. Oh my god, it's a ten. Okay. All right, you, you only break a little bit. Okay, so I'm just gonna like trail behind from when she, where she came from, maybe like snoop in her room. You take. <laughs> I'm a horrible person. You're steal this old lady's heart medication and then <laughs> die. Well, I'm sorry, I hope leader. you do that. I hope <laughs> you 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 overdose on something. I'm not taking the Adderall. This is for your stupid fucking gator. This is yours. <laughs> as you roll a thirty, you bump one of the table legs as you try to come up from underneath, and the woman notices you. Oh shit! Um, uh, immediately, immediately <laughs> she doesn't really know exactly what you are. All they know is they just see some sort of shape there. Uh, she goes ahead and notices you. They think they, that you might be some sort of animal. They quickly usher you out of the house with a broom. Hey, hey, hey uh, Riz, Riz time! <laughs> they quickly, nope, they quickly usher you no, out of the house. And you, see the you see the address, 1001. Oh, oh, great. So we're right next to the. Well, at least we got Adderall out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I was one off. One off the guy's building. I robbed an old lady, stole her steak. I hate myself. Uh, I'm just gonna go. So all, okay. All three, all three of you. All three of you are uh, still in the sewers. Uh, he chose the right house. So now all that's left is the middle and the left for you. I'm just gonna like. I'm just gonna like in sit in a corner and cry and wait for everyone else. <laughs> okay. All of you. Can I give the gator the cool hat? You can if Hatson allows it. Hatson. Hatson, do you allow the cool hat? Hello? Sorry. Sorry. Hatson, do you allow the gator to have the cool yeah. hat? Oh, all yeah. right. The gator, gator has. 40, 40 points of Riz. He's oh, been hell yeah. the Gator acquires the cool hat as his intelligence is now raised by one point. Oh my god. What? <laughs> and, and, uh, and, it, and it must acknowledge me as a homie now because I gave it a hat. So the gator the gator is indeed chill like that. Roll for yeah. dap up. Exactly. Oh, oh my god. Based. That shit claps as it echoes throughout the entire sewer with a mat 19. That shit clap as you clasp your freaking hand and scaly hand together, it just echoes throughout the entire sewer with the reverberation of that dap up. Eater, my homie, bro. 
You are now tapped up with the gator. All right. True. So, which Me house do you wish to go in next? Together. I'll go. All right, Patch. Which house do you wish to go in? Uh, I was. I went to the middle. All right, you went to the middle. You come on up through the uh, toilet the same way that he did. All right. As you can see, the door is open, and what? as you look, as you look inside, it seems like the house is almost vacant. Uh, I'm gonna go in and check it out. All right, go on ahead. You're now standing. Where would you like to go or do? Um, I'm just gonna wait. Can I have a perception check? Go right ahead. All right. You're all a 14. You notice that the bath is still recently filled, it seems like, and also that uh, the uh, neighboring room seems to be some sort of living space. Hmm. Let, let me, can I look around the bathroom real quick? Uh, all right, let's, let's go around around Get us more Adderall. Yeah. You look inside the medicine cabinet to no available, not no available, no avail. Uh, there's nothing inside the medicine cabinets. All right. Let's uh let's walk out of that bathroom and check out another room. Bro. All right. As you go outside, you see nothing more than a small patio and some decrepit stairs that seem to be very creaky if you were to walk on them. Uh, be careful, right. like said Moss. Um. You know what? Let me if, let me check out the bedroom real quick. All right. Oh. As you go ahead and creak open the door, you see some sort of occupant asleep. Yeah, fuck that. I'm just gonna go down to the living room. Alright, as you enter in, you go ahead and take a peer outside of the living room window and you see some sort of mailbox in the front. You see it labeled 1000. Bonk said get the pillow patch. Pillow patch. 1000. Wait, wait, what was that guy's address again? 1000. Oh, I am literally in the room. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna look around. I'm just gonna, like, search through some stuff. Alright, not a bad choice. Seventeen. All right. As you notice that there, as you notice to look around the house, when you look outside the window, you notice that there isn't really a second floor to the house. It seems to lead right to an attic. Hmm. I'm gonna go in the attic. All right. But it is creaky. Do you wish to go ahead and try to stealth with disadvantage, or do you have some other way to try to get up there? Stealth. All right. Whoa. Stealth with disadvantage. Bonk said, Ooh. "Use the rope." 911 wait wait no wait 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 god damn it 11 9 chill 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 I it was it was with disadvantage you rolled a 9 and there was an okay so <laughs> just just what? pass her roll please yeah it was it was a plus it's a plus 5 on stealth she got a 14 uh, as she goes ahead and manages to somehow quietly creak up those stairs without it making a single wooden groan, manages to get up to the depths of the attic as you see nothing more than a small wooden desk near a window with a candle lit. Huh. Does, Long does the, uh, uh, the perception perceptions check, please? Oh, and the attic more. <laughs> <laughs> roll for roll for dumbass. <laughs> yeah, roll for dumbass. You rolled no. seven, the lucky number. All right. <laughs> who, roll for perception. Who, who leaves a fire? Ten another seven. Your ghost to sleep. I don't know. I don't know this guy. All right. Apparently. As you, with your seven, you have to go ahead and take a closer look as you approach the desk. You start to notice contents of what seem to be some sorts of generic papers regarding what seems to be bills, almost. Oh. Look through the papers. Look farther. I'm gonna look through the papers. The 19. You look farther and farther, you keep looking, and you notice that in between the lines, these aren't normal. It's as oh. if they're disguised. Oh. You look read between the oh. you read code. between the line you read between the lines and hear mentions of Box prices of different gemstones. <gasps> he knows. Write that shit down. As you go ahead and try to write shit down. <laughs> 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 Sorry. <laughs> That was great. <laughs> to go ahead to write shit down, you start to hear footsteps creaking behind you, going up the staircase. Fucking hide! Alright, you attempt to hide. With 17. Let's go. The man goes up the stairs, as you see what seems to be a fairly tall, well-built man of perfect health, even in this poor economy. He goes up and goes up to the desk, noticing something's off. Oh no. Oh my god. 
Oh fuck, I'm done. <laughs> he matches your check, and he throws a dagger out right in your direction. Dodge. This man. This man is on a Motherfucker. Okay. It, it fails. It manages to pierce throat, pierce through your cover as it manages to hit you right in the frickin' chest. Ooh. It's a shallow cut, but it still hurts nonetheless. This man, his, his senses are his senses are honed. Fuck, and yeah. I'm by myself. Yo, mitigators. <laughs> yeah, can I run inside? I thought. I, I mean, thought I know I, I have. I know I technically have no insider knowledge, but I mean, you guys have been taking a long ass time, and I've just been sitting here crying. So let me just like bust into the fucking house. All right. I feel, like, I feel, like, medics, like, listen, I feel like medics the type of person to just bust down the door, or is the door open to uh, the, his house? She can just uh, bust down the door. Yes, it is. Too. It's open. Oh, yeah, it it's is? just wide open. Okay, what a fucking open. idiot! All right, I'm going in. And then, and then I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna go in completely unaware. Put me on disadvantage if anything. Like if I find out what's happening. There you go. As you run straight through the doors, you feel something hit your shin—a thin wire. What? What the fuck? You rolled a three to notice the trap that was set. Uh, As you go ahead and step through the door, the wire breaks, and some sort of flat object goes ahead and swings right towards you to bludgeon you. This oh, This dude's got a trebuchet. He fails and knocks you right out of the house, right onto your backside. It fails I to kill you. I deserve however, this. however, you are completely knocked with the wind out of your body right now. Okay, I got mob that psychoed. Is I, I, this is my fault. I did this off screen. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Never do shit off screen. Exactly. Oh. Right. Uh, what? What? Okay. Ah. I'm, I'm stuck with the guy who fucking. Ah. <laughs> Spider-Man okay, fucking sensed me for some reason. All right, so. Well, Bonk and Hatson, you two are still just in the sewers waiting for them to return. You two are much more patient. Oh, well, at least, least Hatson's more patient. Tunnel. I thought. Well, did you? Went was... to the tunnel to where? Was there Bonk not a third no, tunnel? No. You said there were three. There was. There you, was you, three. You two are in the third tunnel. Yeah. Oh, are we still oh. walking down it? Oh, then that means yeah, you guys are preoccupied. They're doing their own thing. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, Patch, as the man goes ahead and pretty much notices Boxing where you are immediately, you notice that this man's senses are sharper than the average man. He's playing a coy. Oh. He goes ahead and rushes towards you on the opposite side of the room to try to come get you. Uh... I'm oh dead. Oh my god. <laughs> said brothers of Here was a nat 20 and manages to immediately tackle you right... <laughs> With almost athletic speed, he manages to run right across the room and... <laughs> No. Bro, it was one is enough. <laughs> so he manages to run across the room right at you with athletic speed and manages to almost stuff you right through the wall, splinters covering oh, your body. Damn. Ah, motherfucker, dude. Bro. She has rather abnormal strength compared to most people. Well, can can I? I it's, it's, medic. Yeah. You hear this commotion. What do you wish to do? Wait, am I breathing again? <laughs> yes, it just knocked the wind out of you. Okay, um, now that I'm breathing again, <laughs> let me just, like, go in extremely slowly so I don't instantly die. <laughs> Alright. Crap again. <laughs> as you crawl on through, as you crawl on underneath the trap, you go ahead and hear the, where the sound came from, from the attic, as you hear a struggle upstairs. Oh, shit. How do you wish to approach the stairs? Bonk said we um, just run up. Really just run up. Alright, you Balls go ahead and run up. With disadvantage, you rolled a five, and as you step on the step, you notice one of it collapses as another trap was I set. hate this shit. <laughs> this house was prepared for you. This is not. This, this, this is this not. House is not house. This house is not my fucking place, man. As the floorboards trap you, your shins begin bleeding as you realize the skin is getting pierced by wooden splinters that have fallen through where weak spots in the floorboard once was. It's gonna take you a turn to get out. A uh, roll for depression. <laughs> roll for depression. <laughs> Uh, okay, I am okay. I am completely uninhibited. My mind is a steel trap. <laughs> awesome. All right, all right, Patch. How, Patch, how do you plan on reacting to this fight? Oh fuck! I I would try to talk about him, but there's no talking to him. So I'm gonna try Riz. and <laughs> fucking no words. I'm gonna just try oh, and get nuts. fucking yak knock his nuts out. The family jewels. 
He rolls an 11, manages to kick him in the leg, and it definitely hurts him a bit, but it definitely does not stop his onslaught. He's still going. Bro. Let's see. All right, go ahead and see if his punch lands. It does with your armor class. He manages to land another uh, sheer bludgeoning attack. You're oh. still going, but it's definitely a hard battle. Medic, you're out for this turn. Patch, go Sorry, ahead. What do you wish to retaliate with? Fucking, I, I fucking, I'll pull out my dagger and try to stab him in the neck. I don't have a choice. All right, don't. you go ahead and try to retaliate with that force. Motherfucker! As you, try to, as you try to pull it out, he manages to put it back in your pocket. With no. your hand. He continues the onslaught and tries to almost push you through the walls of the building. Continues onwards. I thought I was good at hand to hand. Head. I'm gonna die! As he pushes you through the wall, he manages with just sheer force, slams you through the wall, and you both are outside the house on the street. What? Oh my. I'm dead. There ain't no way. <laughs> All right, this Honestly, leaves you I mean, patched with about seven so health remaining. Oh, so Along with this, oh, actually, wait with the strength modifier. Oh, that's uh, yeah, at five health. What is the bomb? All right, medic. Medic, you hear the commotion going on. You hear the wall break. How do you want to approach this? Now okay, that you got out the trap. I'm gonna go out in a sh since they're outside. I'm gonna turn 180 degrees, walk oh, in a shit, straight line, shit. get out of the stairs, go under the tripwire, and never go back in that house again. Fuck's sake! <laughs> as you manage to get out the house, as you manage to get out the house with the first turn here with your speed and efficiency, you're gonna be at disadvantage for your first roll of the fight, but you're finally present. Oh, thank you God. See you see what seems to be the strong man fighting against Patch with, with what seems to be almost brutal strength. How do you wish to approach this, Medic? Okay. Uh, fuck. Do I still- I, I have my key from the short rest, right? Yes, you did take a short rest before this, fortunately. Alright. It's time to flip the coin! <laughs> oh, I'm You're gonna try to turn the odds! Yeah. Alright, uh, call, call it even or odds. Uh, even. Fuck my life. Okay, I'm at you more disadvantage. You're vanished. Okay. Um, so now I'm just gonna go in and just like punch him in the mouth. I don't know. <laughs> Martial arts right, shit. Go ahead with disadvantage here. Okay. You only roll a four. He manages to go ahead, turn around, and parry that attack before kicking you to the ground. This dude is a non-stop, bro. This dude's non-stop. <laughs> <laughs> he is. He is not normal from at least what you guys know. Wow. Yet. One day you. Bitch! <laughs> Alright, Patch. While he's focused on Medic, what do you wish to do? Hatton and Bonk are just rubbing in a fucking gator's fucking stomach while me and Medic are getting what? their asses whooped up top. Oh, bo Bonk said I want to tame birds. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's see uh, if you tame some birds. Wow. No. A one. <laughs> You notice your presence single handedly caused a bird's migration a season early. <laughs> wow. Damn, that's rough. Okay, you know, you know it's what? also it's also doesn't help that we're in the sewers. I don't know if there's birds down there. There's like two. Uh, there's at least all right, two. Alright, right, patch, while he's focused okay, on medic, how okay, do you wish okay. to take care of this? Uh perception, well, that's see that's see if he's wait, can I just check out like by all the stuff that I've seen oh, see. Does he respect nobility? Uh, from what you see, the man seems to have been tampering with something. You notice that his house definitely certainly wasn't expected for any visitors, and yet the door was left open anyways. Mm. You remember that? Yeah. Okay, yeah, okay. definitely not the nicest man around. Yes, so... Do I still get to do an action? Uh, yes. Okay. Um, fucking... It's fucking cunning action. Cunning? Oh, you're gonna use your bonus action, alright. What do you wish yeah. to do with it? I'm just gonna try and stab him. Oh, you're gonna dash over to him and stab him. Let's see here. Yeah. While he's focused on medic, you have advantage here. 16 with your plus 5 here. You managed to go ahead, stab him right in the back of the neck, making it a critical here. Double fours. All right. All right. Wait, with your uh, modifier here. That does a total of 14 damage to the man. He's almost incapacitated almost immediately. Nice. He's, he's brought to the ground as, uh, despite his Monks well immense strength. Smell to them being hurt. Uh, yeah, gators actually have uh, advantage on any kind of smelling check. Oh shit! They have keen smell. Nice. Bonk said, "Make him smell." All right. <laughs> Make him smell. <laughs> he does. We're in the sewers. <laughs>
<laughs> you rolled a eight on a, with an advantage. Uh, the gator does not notice any hint of the fight as you two continue onwards, trying to see what's in the other house along with the tunnel. All right, but the man is brought down to the ground by that just very decisive strike made by Patch. Now he is not dead, but he is incapacitated, and he is open to conversation. Okay. Let me take a deep breath. Let me go up to him, breathe down his neck a little bit, and just be like, bro. Okay, right, so what can I ask this guy? <clears throat> Where were you on the night? I'm sorry. Uh, what's the deal with the vigils? What's with all the sigils? Yeah, what's with all the Did I say vigils? I'm a fucking moron. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a dumbass. Okay, what's with all the sigils, you shithead? As Medic approaches the man, confused about what he meant by what's with the sigils, the man is just as confused. How do you not know about the sigils? What? What? Wait, uh, grab him by the shoulder and just be like, What do you mean? What do you mean? Explain to me! What do you mean by that? It was a missing point! <laughs> He's probably going to lose this. I'm give me, impressed. give me all of your information. Every single one. The sigils. Or I will Are fucking, you or I will Are give you, you the goblin special. Me? Are you not here to come after me? No. We, we just want to figure out what the hell is going on around here. Hmm. If you know the sigils, aren't you one of them? I am. We are not one of them. We've killed like four. Was it four or was it five? Because including the set of people. I can't count. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so this wasn't an assassination for me again? No! No! We don't even know who you are. We just found out this address from the a king's court. Quiet down up there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, we're trying to fi finish our game of chess. Or start playing it. Jesus, okay, we, just... we are playing chess. <laughs> okay, exactly. let's, can we just take him, like, carry him inside so we don't have to deal with whatever the yes. fuck is going on down there in the sewers? Bonk said yes, and as, uh, as you bring the man in, courtesy, he definitely respects to some degree. He's equally confused. I thought the two of you were sent here to kill me. No, we thought I you were- We thought you were the one endangering us. We thought you were behind these stupid sigils and all the- You're using the daggers just like those other guys too. What's with that? That is true. There's- There's been so many of them. I can't live in my- anymore. They're just always coming here. I, I don't allow visitors. I know it's just always going to be them. A knock at my door and it's just another dagger coming here. Well, then all let right. us help you. We need all the information we can get so we can figure out what's happening around here and stop this from the inside out. Uh, we kind of killed the king. Just wanted to let you know. Uh, that was a complete accident. Just, that, was, just, that was a complete and total accident. The king's dead. That's down. why the guards are going ape shit everywhere right now. But we need to yeah, find also, out what's going on. We know we found this obelisk. There's just so much that we need from you right now. So can you tell us anything? Um, I have a question. Do you know who's going after you? Rook. It, masks. It, it's masks. Masks. We're aware of those masks. The ones that float. What can you tell us about those? Yeah. Ever since I... You, you've probably heard of it already, thanks to that king. When he sentenced us to going down there, he's... He equipped us, and ever since we left the cave, we haven't been left alone by these stupid masks since. The masks have been so many of them. After the cave expedition? Huh. Yes. In the center of... It, it was concealed as some sort of festival town, but we know what it really is. It, how did, how did you survive? You're the only one who survived. How did you come back? Interesting move. Let's see how this plays out. This crystal oh, that I was holding, it, it, it almost had some sort of attune me, attunement with me. It, it, it wanted to be with me. It wanted to keep me safe. The air Why down there, it's not normal. I, I guess I have no choice to help. Do any of you have any way to heal me? Um, um, we've got a bard. Have... We've got a bard back a while back. He's got some healing ability. We still have a healing potion. And another guy just like me. We've got this potion as well from a merchant. A while back, I don't know if it helped you in any way. What do you need healing from, though? You seem fine for the most part. Bro, uh, are the blood all over my neck? I, I got this. I got this medic. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll I apologize. Okay, I'm not the smartest individual. It's fine. I'm not the smartest individual. I'm blind with rage right now. Your stupid fucking log trap knocked me out. The fine. You know, patch, take it away. Patch, take it away. You know what? I'll, I'll. You know what? Because I made that injury, I'll help you like bandage it bandage it up and everything i apologize <laughs> we just... thank you we, that that trap wasn't meant for you it was meant for the ones wearing the masks it's yeah, still hurt like a really... bitch though yeah. 
if you guys really are after it, then I, I guess I'll come help. There's no one else now that can. If we can yeah. just put a stop to this and I could just live in my house normally for one day, I, I'll i go with you guys. I'll go down. Let's go. Where's the man that can heal me? Okay. Right. Um, he's down the sewers. I hope you don't mind the smell. <laughs> we need to all get right. back. As all of you go ahead and carry the man down to the contents of the sewers, he is slightly bewildered by the sight as uh, Hatson and Bonk all are, are, well, still allied with all their animals, but he accepts it nonetheless. He's certainly seen we he's certainly seen weirder. No, I don't, two, sorry. All of you are now grouped now with the newfound knowledge of this man, and we shall end it here for all where right. you shall go next. Is all right. Jesus Christ. All right, and that's it for today's session. That was the most scuffed wow, piece of dialogue I've ever done myself. <laughs>